drop, and then everybody comes to L.A. Now, people... Okay, academics. Wait, hold on, wait, hold on. Let me just, let me just well, set ahead, it up. Go ahead, get off, yeah. get off, get off. Go so, ahead. So, so people pause, then pause. start saying it's it's Brick Baby. Now, I was I didn't really know too much about like some of this. And even when you, you, you made that comment, we'll get to that. I didn't, like, I, I know fans say a lot of stuff. Like, there was a time fans were saying, oh, yeah, no, you, you don't. Because I did an interview with Dirk, and he literally said you can't say it no more. But I'm going to be honest with you. Whack 100, Loose Cannon, and 600 gave a compelling argument to basically said it was you who's co-conspirator for and that you were working undercover because you had another case. You, I'm, glad, I'm glad you didn't run from all this and you're actually addressing everything. What do you know, um, and what could you tell us about this whole thing? And are you consp- co-conspirator number four? Uh, so basically, if you look at the paperwork, right? Yeah. Uh, if you if you look at the paperwork, co-conspirator number four is somebody that was in a conversation on November 6, 2020. Did mm. you did you think that? Wait, wait, wait. Say that one more time. Okay, November 6, 2020, co-conspirator number four was in a conversation, had a conversation with Dirk. It's no way possible it was me because on November 6, 2020, I was in jail. Oh. Uh... You know what okay. I'm saying? So, so that clears me out of that. I, you know what I mean? Like, just that. But what are my fans playing towards that to make it smoother and to the point? It's okay. no way that it was it was me. And then I wouldn't be sitting here shaking ass. I, I'd be somewhere else being tucked up trying to be, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> I'd be out the way. Okay. I, it ain't no way possible I would just sit here and be this bold. Hey, I'm 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 glad you I'm glad you you said that. So to 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 um to chat, we have the indictment up on the screen, and um this is page six of twenty one yeah. of the original indictment. If you go to overt act one, it says following the killing of Davon Bennett, um on or about November sixth, co-conspirator one used coded language, and this was in 2020, told defendant DD, co-conspirator two, four, and five, that he would pay a bounty or monetary reward to anyone who took part in the killing of Quando Rondo. So you're saying you're in jail. I'm in jail. I get released two days before Thanksgiving that that year. So like three weeks later I get released. Ah, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, you know I mean, so I couldn't have been a part of that conversation. I'm not saying that, but it's not me. But I'm just not. I'm not saying that the person couldn't be in jail that was a part of the conversation too. But it's it's no way possible me like just off of that alone. Yeah, nobody talking crazy like that on no jail phone. Okay, so 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 you know what I think though. I thought when you said it, even with you know whacking everybody, said I said man. Brick might not be the person who's co-conspirator for, but he probably knows the person. Is that a possibility? <laughs> he too knows you, bro. <laughs> and I'm serious. <laughs> because it felt, I get it, you said that you were getting like, you know, people DMing you, you were, you were kind of leaning into a troll, because that's what you said, right? Like you said, you said um, they can't say slide for Vaughn anymore because you were leaning into the troll, right? No, what I was doing, yeah, yeah, yeah. But if you notice, you, you was paying it. Because you you knew when that clip went semi viral earlier on, yeah, when it went viral, remember? Mm-hmm. Okay, so what I was saying was, as soon as it happened, the fact that it happened in L.A., everybody got to DM me like you did that you slid for Vine, you slid for Vine, you slid for Vine. They can't say don't slide for Vine. Meaning my fans, the trolls. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. At this point, me and Dirk, we not even see it eye to eye over some shit that happened after D thing passed away. Okay. You get what I'm saying? And it ain't even on nothing like that, but it just got something to do with like like some weird stuff and he wasn't thinking right. We had got over it a little bit after that. So it was like an eight month time span where I just hadn't had no contact with 
nobody over there. Mm. Okay. So, all right. All right. Makes sense. Now, so when I was trolling, when I was trolling, I was playing like, okay, you know, we don't got nothing to do with it. Don't know. Everybody know we don't got nothing to do with it. Because if I say, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going to just say something about it and play. You know what I mean? I'm playing on to it. Like, nigga, they can't say that no more. And then I'm tired of bro having to go through them comments. So it's me, like, shutting that shit down. Like, somebody said for my nigga, even if it wasn't motherfucking. You know what I mean? It was I, I I didn't know the truth behind, and even if that is even the truth, I mean the wiretap is hard. It, it's it's looking ugly, but at the end of the day, it's always a way. If if if, if there's a will, there's a way to get up out of a situation. So if, if it is true, that's just a coincidence. Hey, I swear hey, to God, bro. I know it sounds crazy no, coming no, out. Hold on, on my mouth, I'm not saying it's you, but I think you know a lot more than what you're leading on. I'm gonna tell you why. Let me give you the evidence that, that I see. <laughs> Well, well, why did Quando, after that happened, he stopped claiming neighborhood? That feels like you got backdoor by neighborhood. Man, because things just don't be knowing what's going on, man. And it, I, I think because he knew that he had an indictment coming his way, so he he, he, he dropped this flag to, to you know, like how... No, but I, I, no, hold on, I, and I could pull that up. He, a lot of what he said is one thing if he's like, yo, you know what, man, man, this shit's stupid, man. I, I, I don't want to be um, involved in this anymore. He was talking about damn near like betrayal and people not holding him down. And that felt like maybe he went out to L.A., put his, you know, his life or protection or quote unquote checked in with. The streets be talking act like at the end of the day, but, you know, I, it ain't for me to say who. You know what I mean? Like, maybe later on in life, uh, motherfuckers figured out certain shit, but it ain't for me to talk about. All right. You know, I, I feel like we're talking around a little bit. So I'm going to ask you a direct question. Answer nah, because you, you asking me, do I know more about it? And I'm telling you, like, you that know. wouldn't be the <laughs> correct shit to talk about right now if you gave a fuck about Brick Baby, you know? No, no. All right. So, so essentially, you're saying you might have some knowledge um, um, more than what you're, you're leading on with, but like you gonna keep it off the internet because it ain't for the internet, basically. You did okay. All right. Um, now was there any blowback to that for you? Because you know, when I looked at it, you see, I look at it in a different light. I look at them like, damn. Well, if I'm Quando or if I'm anybody else, I'm gonna look at Brick to. Let's say you work as co-conspirator for. I'll look at you as a backdoor guy, like. And like, oh, okay, you told me you're going to hold me down. And then, of course, you told people where I'm going to be at that they could come rob me. If Quando listened to Brick Baby telling him he was going to hold him down while he was in L.A., he was trying to. You get what I'm saying? Like, I don't even see. I don't even see Quando even thinking no crazy shit like that. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, what he called that'd be the goofiest shit that he is. like if I went to Savannah and Quan told me I'ma hold you down while I'm here, I think I'ma hold off on that pass. Mm. Hey, so so could you could you explain, right? Could you explain um could you explain that the face the series of facial expressions you went through when you found this shit out? People said that that was a sign of guilt. Nah, it was a sign of shock. Because I thought that they were gonna be adjudicated within like LAPD or something like that, the LA County, you know what I mean? Like it would have been a little bit easier for him, man. When I seen that the feds grabbed him, it, like him being my own boy, it kind of, you know what I mean? It kind of gave me chills, like seeing my boy fighting the feds, and I'm I'm finding out live, so I just was like, damn. This is crazy. And then I, it, it did run through my mind, like, damn. But they trailed me thinking I was, you know what I mean? Like, some shit like that. I, okay, and, and by the way, it's okay, it's okay if you can say you can say no comment. So, WAC 100 accuses you of having federal interaction in terms of uh, police supposedly raised your spot, caught you with a gun, whatever the case is. Have they ever asked you about anything to do with this? And if you can't answer that question, it's fine. 
But how nah, they, they never asked me nothing to do with nothing. They ain't never. I I wouldn't even talk about nothing. Like this stuff, like, I went in there. I wish that they could have my transcript. I told the people like whatever you want to know about Zaire and Mitchell, we can talk about that. Yeah, anything other than me, like the questions you got about me, I can answer. You know what I mean? Off the rip. So it was times where they tried to negate, and, you know, shit like that. But mm. It ain't nothing. You know what I mean? Did you, were you any type of nervous? You know, because again, again, maybe, maybe you're not involved, but like, you know, you, we know with these cases, and look, look what's happening with Jeffrey Williams, a.k.a. Young Thug in um, Fulton County. It looked like they picked up anybody who was at the smoke sesh. You know, it's like, all right, we're just going to grab everybody and figure it out later. And you might not be involved directly, but, you know, uh, should I learn later? Like, yo, you and Dirk are pretty cool. And based on that, they're saying there was local help. Never know. They could be like, yo, if you and him communicate, they could be like, yo, let's throw him in there. Were you nervous at all to say, yo, are they going to wrongfully pick me up? Nah. At this point, it's no it, the way that they coming with the OTF jam dude. They not finna wrongfully pick nobody up. You mm. gotta think. Act, they just had somebody working with a wire. Mm. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. They just had somebody working working with a wire. What the hell do they need Brick Baby or anybody else for at this point? Like we gotta just think like reasonable like. This person was way closer to Dirk than Brick Baby. He can get the darkest secret. He getting dropped on every song, every three out of five songs that come out, you got jam in there. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Hey, hey, hey let me ask you a question. Because this is like Wax Angle right here, and, and, and 600 said the same. They said that you as a podcaster now, the, the way how you're fucking up is that you're saying street shit on the mic, and that might that might kind of spur things and narratives and make situations hot, and they feel that's like a form of telling. Do you feel like you've brought anything from the streets that probably shouldn't have been on the microphone and and spoke about it? A hundred percent, a hundred percent. I'm learning in live time though, bro. So it's like. So some people got to kind of give me a, 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 a pass on that because it's like I, I'll have a conversation and I'm potting, but then I will turn this conversation into a regular conversation because I'm getting too comfortable. And when I'm talking, I'm just talking like I'm chopping it with the guys and it ain't a conversation you should have on a long train. Did, did you... Or a stream, period, any type of interview. So sometimes, but I, if you look at my more recent content, I ain't been doing. You know okay, what I mean? So I kind I, of. I appreciate off. that answer. You, you, you basically say you learning on the fly, and there's times you probably said shit you probably wish you didn't. Hey, um, have you have you talked to anybody in Dirk's camp since? Um, even just be like, yo, is everything good? Or you know what I mean? Like, just even just communicate because I'm guessing you had a relationship with them where y'all communicated. Have you communicated with anyone over there yet or no? Um, I think everybody over there probably is in the, and probably just trying not to use their phone at all. Mm. Did, did you have to reach I out mean, to you them? You know what I'm saying? Like, no, no, I, I, get that. I, I but, feel like if but, I call to tap in right now, now that'd be sufficient. Even if it's just like a, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I can, but I also, they could be thinking. In. I just send some hearts out, you know what I mean? Like, I show them my love and respect. Yeah, yeah, but they could be thinking what the internet is saying, which is, oh, Brick is this co-conspirator that's on name. You, you, you never know. Like, you know, obviously the people close to it would probably be like, man, Brick ain't got nothing to do with it, but... Some other people could be like, man, what the fuck? So did you at least like try to read some feelings to be like, yo, listen, I, I just want to let y'all know that shit is. Well, the, the 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 people that's over there that I deal with, that's really my people, they're my brothers. Okay. So they already know. We This is what I'm saying. We've all been together. Like, you know what I mean? Like, we've all been together and kicked it after all that. We got over our stuff or whatever the case is. They know that I ain't on no timing like that. Like, they know. 
the 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 the, the paperwork going to show everything in due time like and even if i was like that's even more of a reason not to 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 talk to you know what i'm saying but i don't even it's so much touchy stuff with me being a podcaster, me calling right off the rip, asking questions and shit. Of course, they gonna curve me anyway because they think I'm gonna go right. You know what I mean? Yeah, then no, no, I, I definitely know that. That's why I don't hit up a lot of people <laughs> right after shit happens because they don't think you're reaching out sincerely as like a friend or somebody who cares. They think you're reaching out to get info to be able to kind of have an angle. You know what I mean? Yeah, they ain't trying to get you. You know what I mean? And I've been catching a lot of that. I've lost a lot of friends being a I've noticed, I've noticed that my rap friends that used to tap in a lot, like they had tap in on off the like certain shows, but like just on the regular pull up and all that stuff, they they been cool. Like you know what I mean? Like I could go to the club, do all that type of stuff, but like it used to be to the point where we pulling up at each other house on the day to day. Now that I'm on the podcast, it's like. I, we don't want you to know our day to day routine no more, nigga. You might you, you mm. talk to them, but yeah. <laughs> hey, um, did, did you have any? So, so we know Dirt got locked up, and then the uh, five other people or four other people, I can't remember how many. But did you have any like close relationship with the other guys? Like whether it was Dee Dee, um, Bonnie, um, Boogie. Um, did you have any? So. Let's clear that Boogie shit up. I got a little homie named Boogie that's doing 10 years right now. Free Boogie. His yeah. name is uh, R.S. Uh, you know what I'm saying? He from the hood. So when I'm talking about Boogie, I'm talking about the Boogie from my hood. It's not OTF Boogie. I never met OTF Boogie a day in my life. Then you got... Uh, I know I know, I know, know uh, Didi and Monty because they always with him. Hmm. Mm. Uh, I feel like uh, it it'll come out in the paperwork probably later on. Vani is 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 um, employed by OTF. He's not really a street dude. Hey, hey, hey let me ask you a question because this thing is blowing up my phone. Um, uh, um, um, Wack wants me to add him. He said you're spinning me right now. He 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 has the right question. He says no bullshit. He, he just want to ask you questions directly. No, it's good. We went through this earlier on my stream, but it's good, though. I, I ain't tripping. Add him in. All right, let's see. Whack, call back. Call back, Whack. Yeah, I I don't know why they think. Yeah, Have you ever met Whack? Who, me? Yeah. Nah, we was, I, we. Okay, we gonna get this going on, Chad. This is gonna be prime content. Yo, what, 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 Hold on, here we go. Yo, what up, man? What up? All right, we got um, Brick Baby, we got Whack 100 on the line. Yo, yo. Oh, what up, man? Yo, 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 we got Brick on the line, Whack. Man, I just got through running the New York room with Bimmy and motherfucking Zip. So, you know, we exposed has been hard at work. What's up, Brick Baby? What's going on, Whack? My God, he didn't say cuz. Got this guy real. <laughs> you know, like yo, I yo, see yo, we got, you know, we got. Whack, I, I did a we whole. We got the exposures on the pro Brick baby. Salute your big homie. <laughs> <laughs> man, what's going on, man? What you talking about? Salute my big homie. <laughs> Who, who's big that, homie. man? <laughs> hey, what up, Brick? <laughs> what's going on? My, oh, 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 my goodness. <laughs> <That's your man. laughs> what up, Brick? What's going on, what up, man? Oh, man. Yo, what up? What up? Did I lose? The one and Luke. only. Yeah. Wait, wait. Loose is is Brick's big homie? Mm. For sure, so, he man, know. Man, come on with all that. Stop all doing right. that, guys. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. That's hold why. on. That, that, it, he's in the middle. <laughs> Hey, by the way, uh, Whack, so so we, we went over the indictment, and you gave some compelling reasons why you said it, it appears that, number one, Brick brought some information to the internet that nobody knew, and how yeah. would he and how would he know that? And based on the description of what a co-conspirator for is, it seems to be him. Huh? Now, Brick's response is that, how could he give the drop on somebody? He claims he was like in Atlanta or something like that. So... What's what's the middle ground here? I don't know, Brick. Was you in LA or Atlanta? 
No, I was in Houston. Oh, Houston. Yeah. Oh, my God. You told me Atlanta early. Yeah. Did you see no, that? You, you the whole world knows I was in Houston because I loaded up. That's when I was but, I was going from Houston to Dallas Fort Worth. That happened but you when said I it on, uh, in Fort Worth. You something you was in Atlanta. You said you was in a. But then again, at the end of the day, uh, Brick, you know, Brick did, I, he did admit he was the first one to make the announcement about we all thought he got robbed. It was a motherfucking uh, drag, bad drug deal. This crazy nigga went up there with Mr. North Dakota and said some crazy shit. Why? I think he knows that was some crazy shit. Right? So, I don't know. This shit is all crazy. And I think because of that, that internet shit, they jumped on his line and they wanted his phone. And they, they went after his ass behind that phone. You know, um, <laughs> he just saying shit wait, right I, now. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, break. No, it, it's not. Wait, I, break. I'm saying shit. We had this conversation earlier. Wait, Brick, I, I I know you know you have a, a open case, and, and trust me, you, you don't have to talk about it if, if it's information that's sensitive. But why keep saying that you got your phone seized, that they were after your phone? That kind of makes sense if, if you were co-conspirator for, but you say you're not. Did they raid your house just to take your phone? Nah, bro. Oh, Brick, we, we was just, Brick, we just house. had this conversation. Hey, listen, what I'm trying to tell you, on there... Any time that they're trying to get in your business, they're gonna keep your phone. Since cell phones been out, when I anytime I went to jail, my phone been on evidence. Wait, what did the search warrant say? My phone. I've never not. What did the search warrant say? They Rick? didn't take my phone. Rick, what did the search? We just three hours ago I went just over said that the search warrant said social media. Uh, what, cell phone, phone, cell phone, there it goes. Uh, there you go. Drugs. Yeah, yeah, but the, the thing is with the feds, they would probably say all electronics. Computers. Electronics, phone, yeah, it says that. some electronical shit. That's what I'm trying to think of the shit. It says some electronic something on that motherfucker. Go, go act like I said. Within them coming to look for that, they stumbled across some other shit. Well, are, well, the gun, the uh, well, 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 obviously. Yeah, yeah, bro, 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 bro. All that shit was on the search warrant. It's nothing to keep on. To, the to AK was not on the search warrant. Yes, it, it, it was. It was high power assault rifles. What are you talking about? It's a snitch that been in my house, bro. We've been through that. All right, we went through that. Oh. Right. Wow. Wait, hold on. So, um, Brick hey, also. Wait, wait. What was this at? Brick in the body? No. Uh. Uh-uh. It was in over here. This is when I was in L.A. All right. Yeah. This one I was in I, LA. I, I, I remember I told Brick. you, you remember we've talked about Pesci and all that shit, which could be an angle at, at one point, but I wouldn't even think that. Nigga ain't never been to my house. That's so funny. Hey, Brick. Yes. Did, did you tell that nigga 600 that um they was coming to get Big U? No, nah, I ain't tell 600 none of that. Oh, shit. I didn't tell 600 that. Uh, hey, hold on, hold on. So, so, by the way, so bro, y'all know, y'all know what's going. We're not even talking about. Just leave all them. That's yeah. Wait, hold on. So, 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 so Brick basically hold on, said, so Brick, Brick, you didn't tell six hundred that they was gonna come big you. They was on big you by the Rico. Nah. Hell, hey, you didn't tell me that. I told six hundred. I told six hundred. Chat. Brick baby leaked my number, so like everybody's like calling me like, "Yo, could y'all fans like get a fucking life? Stop calling me, my nigga! Like I'm call me after the fucking call, like what the fuck." Stop going to the hood every day, making them vlogs, nigga. That's what I told six hundred on that phone, and you can put six hundred on the phone right now. He on the phone already. You did say that. How you think? How, how you think everybody knew about this Rico shit? What you mean? How you think everybody know about the Rico? Ain't nobody what told us that you, nigga. What, 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 what Rico have been issue? What Rico are we talking about? You talking about this Rico shit. The Rico, you said that big you got. You said I got the same lawyer, nigga. Man, we, I told you we had the same lawyer. That's what you told me. Okay. That's why when people who don't never catch cases get to talking and lying, they can't really put put a lie together because if we have the same so you didn't so you didn't so so you didn't say that am i lying so you didn't say that can i have the same lawyer on the same case as the nigga 
I mean, y'all, y'all got on the same case, bro. I don't, man, yeah, but this, this, yeah, this, bro. This, this that's not what I tell you. Yeah, ain't no conflict. You got his own Rico. You see, you see, it ain't no six on Rico. He got his own Rico. They want cuz in jail. It's ugly for cuz, bro. It's bad for him. Like I said, I done did this whole conversation about talk. We not about to spin this into no roller sixty shit while you on act shit, nigga. You're crazy. No, no we not. Now, we everything just, that you said, we talking about. This came from the rap. We talked about Dirk and them, bro. Oh, the dead. Oh, this came you got from the rap. That against the set, nigga, because you can't come around no more, nigga. I ain't want to do it. What, what you got a vendetta for the sickness, nigga? You was doing burpees and pull-ups in them parking lot, nigga. You ain't pulled up since, nigga. Bro, I can go to any. any bro, you can't do none of that, nigga. On West Side rolling, nigga. You can't do none of that. Go on. Pull up. Hey, listen, bro. I don't Pull know what you're doing. You know, you know, you got a subject over here. Hey, we, we not going to do that against the hood, nigga. That's what we're doing. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Stop talking about the hood, nigga. Hold on, one second. Did you tell 600 that they've been on you since March? I didn't tell 600. I probably told him 600. I told everybody that. I said that on the live stream. That's what you told him. I said nah. that on the live stream. So if I told earlier, that you and I said that on the live stream, then I might ask. Like, you get oh, what I'm saying? I, 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 I called you to let you know. I called you to give you a heads up and stop being hot. You kept on making shit. You made more. You wanted to be I, How am I making stuff hot? You. You, 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 you want the people to know. You how am I making something hot? Well, I don't participate in nothing that y'all don't participate in. What are We're you talking out. about? What are you talking about? Y'all participated in nothing that y'all participated in. Whatever anybody got going on, ain't no, listen, ain't nobody, listen, whatever anybody what got going on, ain't nothing. What the fuck they in? Ain't you from 6 nigga? Whatever anybody got going on, I don't participate. Listen to me, bro. Whatever, I don't, I don't do no illegal activities. So, so are you, well, you six, you talking listen, about stopped, you don't do what we do, nigga, I we do the best playing. one. I stopped game making in 2015. Right, stop talking about the sex when you don't know what's going on, gang. Please, come on. I stopped game making in 2015. So how am I making something up? Over there, you have a bad day against the hood. You what? took this from a little dark conversation to pop in and try uh, to get five seconds of fame off a big you. I don't even know what y'all talking about. Down, nigga, trying to expose the hood every chance listen, you Listen, right, but bro, he ain't exposing nothing. And it'd be real. No, it's just, it, 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 man, me and you, we was having a conversation, bro. On the hood, man. Was, but what we trying to do is when you got thing, arrested, but when you got arrested like, for the, for about, the little dirt shit, when you got arrested in June, you called 600. I called 600 and gave him a head up. I just told you what I told you. Gave me a head up on what? I'm not involved in nothing. I what gave you a head heads up about you being hot, nigga. You need to calm I'm not the fuck down. I don't do nothing illegal. Wait, wait, hold on, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay. Hey, hey, hey wait, real you quick, real quick. The set every day, giving them a tour of the set. That's not a, That's not nothing. My nigga, I'm vlogging it. Where all the niggas I'm that's vlogging, doing illegal shit is that? Nigga. I ain't never seen nobody doing illegal shit. Illegal shit at every time. You I have never, the camera, I've never, I've never recorded yeah. nobody doing nothing illegal in my life. I got over two thousand videos. I ain't never deleted one. Bro, I said you're going to where the niggas that doing the legal shit is at, nigga. I'm All in shit, South Central LA in my neighborhood. It's every man, it's come on, man. Thing. That ain't just so go back to that motherfucker, nigga. We they, we, we wait. We trying to understand your point. You man, saying we not hot. trying to do nothing. What am I like, making hot? Mute them up. Hey, 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 so hold on. So, so wait, 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 wait. Are are you guys like I, I know you guys kind of veered off the point real quick, but like how hey. confident do y'all think that that you know, Brick is involved in this little Dirk thing, or is it basically you guys are going off no, more of a pattern of behavior? Involved itself, he involved himself when he said what he said with Flacco on it. I involved myself when I pulled up to that donut shop on a nigga and 600 pulled up. Nigga, nigga, with Kev Mac. One of you niggas is title tellers, nigga. Either you or to Kev Mac, nigga. On the hood. As soon as I get on your live, nigga, four, five days later, nigga, um, what is we talking about, nigga? Also, you said they get so out of five days later. About? Then they say your Rick. name up there. What are we talking about here? Rick, I ain't never been to your house. I'm never sad. Been to house. I'm trying name. to tell you. So you said they get to your house four, five days later. Because uh, um, I said that earlier on the stream. Uh, no, what he's, I hear what he said. 
He said he pulled up, and then five days later they hit his house. I get what he's saying. I ain't saying that it's you. I ain't saying it could be the YouTube detectives. I don't know what the fuck, nigga. Mm. I know oh. everybody old hood day hood. I shot a movie. On hood day, I came back. Niggas had me fucked up talking about I can't go to a donut shop I grew up at. Nigga, I pulled up. You pulled up. Nigga. Hey, hey Brick, hey, Brick could I ask you a question? Six days later, that happened, nigga. Brick, could I ask you a question? Like, why do you think, like, what have you done that? It feels like these guys don't like you, man. Like, what have you done, bro? Well, I don't dislike me. These other niggas, I, man, I don't know. I, I, I'm too sorry. Brick, baby. Brick, baby. This is not the point that I don't like you, because <laughs> it's the point that you have to keep it real with the crib. That's it. You mm. keep it real with the Man, you niggas don't. How y'all for you too? I ain't never seen none of you niggas in the Brick, we never, 20, Brick, 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 Brick. Brick. Sweetie, What are you talking about? Sweetie. Brick. Listen, yeah, come on, man. You when I was in the house, hey, I don't want to get it told on academic. Nigga, you yeah. know what's up. Hold on, bro. Niggas can't come up with three homies. I got two floors, nigga. And we was up there about to run a skit, nigga. And you let the nigga Wiz run a skit on run off with you. I ain't seen you since, nigga. You said you ran. We ran a skit where? I said, nigga, I was out about to run a skit with two blowers, nigga. It was the first time I met you, nigga. And we was about to chase the niggas up out of there. And you escort the niggas up out of there, nigga. YG and the niggas. Moving up to the after Black hour, nigga. stuff on your big ass you got right in your place, little nigga. Dead homies, yeah. nigga. YG what? with the 60s. You talking about AYG, the 60s, what I'll ask you. Hey, nigga, he nah, with the 60s. Nah, nigga, I said, nigga, you ain't going nowhere, nigga. Nigga, me and AD pressed you that night, boy. Nigga, why you didn't do that? Where was your skit, nigga? My nigga, once I got up on you, nigga, 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 put a cuz in the car, got right back, nigga, it's not And you got on, and you got on, I got on, I got on, homies, nigga, 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 he with the real six, nigga, we asked him, he told me, I need to ask you, like, put my gun away, nigga, I nigga said, it's police. Hey, he said, nigga, I got, I got my gun out, and it's police out here. I said, man, I'm not chilling out for nothing, nigga. Niggas packed out the homies, nigga. What the fuck is you talking about, nigga? Man, I'm nigga. Clown. Nigga, nigga so the next day, nigga, 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 we had a big-ass meeting. Nigga, 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 you was looking dumb in the motherfucker you had, nigga, on the dead. I ain't seen you since, nigga. Last time I was the nigga, 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 do you know how many niggas we was at? We was in the club with me, talking about here with the homies. I'm like, nigga, who you with? Oh man, I'm releasing it. Oh yeah, what's up with him? I'm like, that's straight. Man, I hear, I hear what you talk, what you saying in your head, nigga. We flex right up on you, big guy. Ain't nobody flex oh, up nigga, on nothing, nigga. We was on care. Nigga, we got you, we got you, and we put you in your place, cause and you been cool ever since. Ain't nobody, nigga, ain't nobody putting up on nothing. Oh, why you didn't really get it? Everybody who said cause got lined the fuck up the next day, nigga. It was so why my face was pretty. The next day, because so you didn't show up and kiss your quick, face, nigga. You didn't show up and kiss your face like everybody man, else got their ass whooped. Every dead, nigga who was up there, nigga, when I pressed him, I got, got dp the next day. I put my mic out. Nigga, on the dead homies, nigga. Now you on popped in homies, the line up. It was a lie. Hey, everybody got their ass whooped. See, this is what you're doing. Look what you're doing. You died. I'm finna stop talking. Now we going too far. Now you going into hood business again. You gotta been dead. Don't give a fuck about nothing. That's when you first came around. Who put you on this motherfucking line? You got big city. What's your name? Don't they call you on this motherfucking line? They like some goofy shit, nigga. First time I met you, man. You was a goofy. First time I met you, nigga. The next time I seen you was in the hood was when you called me. We was on you like a goofy, nigga. Fuck is you talking about, big goofy ass nigga? What are you talking about? Nigga, respect what you do for the homies gang on hood, and that's why niggas ain't going full of fledge on you, bro. Ain't nobody going full fledge on you. You did a whole night, nigga. That's why a lot of niggas started. I done been around that motherfucker all my life. Let's not talk about nigga. You came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got niggas on your ass. Nigga, nigga, you came in, you got nigg
You said I'm crazy. Every address I ever had was nine. I don't, zero, listen, zero, I don't zero, know where you grew up at, nigga. Nigga, every, up every up address at. I had was nine zero hey, zero four three. Hey, buddy. listen, man. What was yours? My shit, is, my shit is submitted in his history, my nigga. I don't know where you grew up at, bro. I can name every address since I was a baby. Been in the 60s, nigga. Why is like that, though? What'd you I say? Oh, yeah, anyway, I, earlier, when I, earlier when I talked to him, right? you the nigga Three. who couldn't come outside after football practice. Go ahead, right? Oh, right. Uh, wait, 600? <laughs> come on, guys. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's first time I met that nigga, I had two kick blowers on bro, my You too big for me not to know you being from the set, bro. You tell his story. First time I seen you, nigga, you, 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 you ain't never swapped no two blowers on my head. You ain't never swapped no big chase, niggas around you. Know, niggas you know, nigga, I you ain't swapped no so what are you talking about what you see me do bro you ain't never squabbled none of the big niggas from the set so, bro, I ain't never seen what, that nigga in the neighborhood in my life, bro. Brick went to Atlanta kind of young, though. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> that might be it. So I, I you didn't come around until 2012, nigga. What are you talking about? 2012? What are you talking bro, about? Bro, under the dad, that was 2011 or 2012 that I seen you. Christopher was, the tax I, man. I was, come on, bro. I was, come on, Christopher the tax man. You're Christopher the tax man. That's how you came around. You acquired the name 600. Who big this 600? Nigga, I'm big Who is 600, big 600? I'm you, big 600, You don't got nigga. your own name from the hood. Who is big 600? Boy, you, boy, you lost. Who is big 600? I just told you I'm big 600, nigga. What did you talk about? Man, you sound crazy. So you came in front of the hood and you got a name, big? Nigga, my man, this is how you don't nigga. know your history. Nigga, nigga. nigga with a pop right? to you just hey, come so one thing, you ain't even lived my foot I'm in some You know the hood got too much jealousy. But you wouldn't know that because you ain't been around like that. Talk about you, big. Stuff, I got five names. You, you don't even know nothing about this. Chat, this is the beginning of a nice Rico. Humboldt County, what university you go to? Bro, you talking about something? Come on, bro. Humboldt County, nigga, you apply for the sheriff. Over 20 years ago. Come on, bro. What are you talking about? Nigga, you, you the cop. You the wannabe cop. You want to be cop. What is this nigga talking about? Oh, hood. You're a wannabe cop. You put that on the hood? Been to a oh, police oh, academy before? Oh, 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 you put that on put the hood? Put that on your daddy. Rest in peace. You ain't never been in a police academy before, I've nigga. I've never been to a police on, academy. Copy, what are you hey, talking about? Nigga, put it on your daddy. Rest in peace. Hey, let me explain to you, bro. I've never yeah, been to a police thought, academy. Nigga. And if I did, I would cheat. That's what I thought. By the way, by the way, by the way, what else are we talking about? What else is we talking about? I just want to ask this one question for clarification, because when I've seen when I've seen like content from whether it's loose um or even six hundred, um it feels like you know, th th there's probably an axe to grind. I don't think it's even with um, Brick. It feels hey, like, hey, it feels they like it's with... They ain't gonna play with my name. Yeah, no, they ain't gonna play with my name. No, Dead yeah, homies. Nobody's yeah, gonna play with my name. Yeah, yeah but, but, if, but, but, but what I was saying is like... Nigga, it, nigga, it, nigga play with your butt. Nigga, nigga fuck is you talking? Nigga, I will nigga, beat nigga, your nigga, ass play with everything about your butt, nigga, 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 Come around. Nigga, nigga, you already know what I was doing, sweetheart. Nigga, talk about nigga, ain't gonna play with that. Nigga, play with your butt, nigga. Shut up, nigga. Put a nigga, put a finger in your butt. Shut up, nigga. Hook a butt. You already know what's gonna happen to you. Hook a book up. So you need to stop it. Hook a butt. I will beat the shit yeah, out of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nigga, nigga, nigga fuck is you I talk about? Nigga, nigga, violate. Shut up, nigga. Shut up, nigga, you're you a nigga bitch. Do nigga, you come around. Come around. Nigga, you the police ass, snitch ass, nigga. Yeah, I know. You I know. I know. You not really from the set. I ain't gonna lie. This is great content. Nigga, you the police ass, snitch ass, nigga. Yeah, I know. I know. You not really from the set. I ain't gonna lie. This is great content. I was trying to do like a little interview. Cause I've been wanting to talk to Brick, but this is better. Nigga, you niggas not from the set, nigga. You, nigga, you a bitch, nigga. You're a you bitch. You not from the hood. Oh, bitch, you got shot up in the hood. Right from the hood. You ain't been to the hood. You supposed to fake nigga. nigga. You, you got shot, nigga. Oh, nigga, nigga they ran to so Atlanta for 16 years. You came back when you was 30 something. You said I went to Atlanta for 16 years. I ain't never been in Atlanta for more than three weeks straight. Nigga, you crazy in the motherfucker. Who told you that? Nigga, I got a baby nigga, 16, nigga, you weird-ass nigga. 
I got a baby Tell 16. Ass, nigga, 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 and I've been in my, my kid life her whole life. Ass, nigga. All LA school. Nigga, you crazy. You ain't never left this motherfucker. You ain't no motherfucking city. Yo, chat, you want to see W instigation? Watch this, watch this. W instigation. Hey, 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 hold on, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Real quick, real quick, real quick, real quick, real quick. Hey, wait, real quick. Hey, hey, hold on. Yo, wait, 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 wait. Real quick, isn't the way how y'all solve these issues to like meet up and like squabble or whatever? Like, why are you guys been arguing for so long? Pull up to the set. Everybody pull up to the set. That's Listen, all we can do. You we can do it in the city. You can't do that. I we, can't. Man, where was y'all no hood day? I'm the only I, nigga that was around the hungry. I'm the only hey, nigga that was around the hood day, bitch. I'm the only one that was around the hood day. I thought I couldn't go. W instigation. For five years at my house, bitch. You said so what? Bitch. You said bitch. what? You know I do hood day at my house for the last five years. Where was you at this Who year? Y'all didn't talk y'all way Who out for that. We do it for five years. Yo, I called Wack and Wack out of these guys and Wack no content. Y'all niggas don't have no money. Too much, nigga. Come back Listen, around. When I, see you, when I see you, Puka Bus, I'm a big ass. When I see you, you when I see you. I was, I was trying to be cool. You better have your head up to the next time when I see you. Big ass nigga, fuck you talking about. Nigga, nigga don't give a fuck about all that. You can't never ever say I'm not no big ass nigga. I'm not no big ass nigga. You're a police ass nigga, bro. You real, what, hey, who put you on? I let six let it go, and then I let you go. Who put y'all on? Where did y'all get put on? Who put y'all on? You're like, oh, you can just tell. By Pete Nice, nigga. Oh, look, you see how I got you hoes. Hey, let me hoes, nigga. I ain't gonna lie after this man I must I, I must earn like a day of protection from the 60s I love y'all 60s I love y'all Chat, there's some annoying fans that keep calling me. I'm going to just three-way myself off another phone. Just give me a second, bro. Like, these fans are just too fucking annoying. Give me a second, Jan. Like, this is too annoying. Hold on. Bum ass fans who kept calling. I just I, I just hit y'all with the script, man. Y'all calling the other phone. I'm on my other phone now. You mad? Y'all mad? You ain't gonna fuck up the content. No, for real. We, 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 everybody, everybody, 
Yo, yo, Brick, yo, Brick. Yo, yo, by the way, Brick, you, Brick, you know you leaked my number, bro? Like, by mistake? I think it was by mistake, though. That's why I've been getting called from fans all day. Nah, nah, it's all good, it's all good, it's all good. God damn it, he did it again. Nah, nah, it's all good, it's all good. It, it, I just, I just, I, nah, I didn't do that shit on purpose. Nah, nah, I tapped him my other phone, it's fine. Oh nah, it's all good, I tapped him my other phone, go ahead. He do nothing on purpose, nigga, but hell. Hey, anyway, I, I, I appreciate you accepting that, that life mistake. Act. Nah, 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 of course the life mistake, nah, it's all good. Cool. Hey, 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 by the way. Hey, hey, you, you know what I mean? Hey, 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 wait, Luz, can I ask you and 600 this question, though? Like. Yeah. Is any of like you know like the vitriol towards Brick? Is it because he's on no jumper and he has more visibility, or y'all just really think he a fuck nigga? This, no, this no, is no, no. Who can put? I'm glad you're keeping it real. Act. Answer the yeah, question. No, we, we we don't keep it real, right? Um, act. Puka Butts is a police nigga. The niggas lies about every single thing. He gets caught in his lies, and then this says the me. dude that said that he got a call from Nipsey before he died. Are you talking? Are you? Dude? What type of you talking about, you're talking about um, Big U, right? Big Useless. The nigga that you I'm said talking that, about you, oh, bro. Yeah, you, yeah, Big Useless call, not Nipsey. Big Useless, remember that. I thought that you said that you talked to Big Useless call. I thought, you told, I thought Nip what? told you to take this music shit to another level. Big oh, Useless right. call. Big but when you call, told Nip, he told you to take the Big music to another level. Call, sweetheart. He told you to don't, take don't, over when he started like he knew he was going to die. You're just a CI. You're a police nigga. He's not fucking <laughs> what nigga. Now, oh, let me go, at, So let me go, at, yeah, This is the thing. Go ahead. I, I never really had no problem with Brick, right? You know, he a couple years younger than me, different cool generation, whatever, 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 right? So, you know. I'm, I don't like niggas that be pressing niggas like bullying niggas. Girl. So last year they was trying to like tell him he can't come to the hood and bully him. I'm like, nigga, y'all got kind of fucked up. Nigga, he ain't never told, nigga. Fuck whatever you niggas talking about, nigga. We're going to be in the hood, nigga. If you got a problem, pull up. So I'm just like on some, because they never told no niggas, so I'm going to pull up. Hey, so wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. You had tried to plan to pull up. You tried to plan to pull up. Nigga, I didn't plan that pull up with you. Nigga, I'm 42 faked and pull it up with me. Nigga, by myself, nigga, and pick it up blue rag, bro. That was not planned. Don't act like you was you, this, went, you okay. came to save a nigga on the dead homies, nigga. I went in there. So and did I not talk to you the day before we were gonna pull up? Without you there. I was already uh, with the homies when you pulled up. No, you wasn't. Chat, we need a on the dead homies counter. Come on. We need a on the dead homies counter. This is great. Whack finally speaks again. I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want to seem like I'm putting up I don't want the, the, uh, let me ask. Let me ask Brick about this video. So, so Brick, apparently, about a month, about a month before Rondo went to LA, you had made a video saying that he had to check in. Is that true? We got content. Nah, that probably was like a year before. Oh, oh so wait, wait, wait. Big you, that, man, that was when the whole little no shit when he did the big you check in. Uh, uh, uh. The podcast, so however long ago that was. Oh, okay, okay. So you're saying that was before? It wasn't like right before, like right before the incident. You were saying, nah, you better hell check no, no, that was at least it was at least like a year, maybe a year and a half in between that. It don't matter. You still had to check in, right? Ah, hey man, he probably had to do what he had to do. I mean, yo, act on the cop. Wait, oh, wait. I what just happened right now? No. It's one of y'all bitch ass niggas who call me. I'm fucking up the content. Give, give me one second. I got to call back Brick. Damn, then I got to call back Whack. Yo. Y'all fans are the worst. Yeah, Brick didn't leak my number like, like because he wanted to. Hold on. Fuck. How do I do this again?
Uh, where's Brick at? Where's the number? Oh, yes, yeah, right here. My, my bad. I got to call Brick back. Brick probably happy that I hung up on him. It's all good. So I'm going to call him on this. And then the number I don't want y'all to get, I'm going to just, I'm going to three-way that number in on it. Ah, W. It's all good. All right, cool. Yeah. Yo. Hello. Yeah, yo, yo, did the whole call just drop? My dad, that probably was God. <laughs> yeah, no, no. That content was probably boring to say. I'm sorry to your chat, bro. No, no, I, they were intrigued because, I, yo, I guess a lot of people know about um some of the stuff like you know you um you and these guys have been going back and forth with. Hold on, hold on. Let me just. I got. I'm gonna add my other phone because right. th 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 these fans keep calling this number. It's all good though. Yeah. Damn, bro. My. Nah, nah. My, it's all good. I, but, I, yeah. I'm about to still. My phone, because it's not stored, so I could have just flicked my phone the other way. No, nah, no, nah, trust me. Listen, I've I've accidentally leaked yeah. people's numbers too, man. Like that's part of the live streaming thing where like like you don't realize how how in real time uh, it is. So it, it ain't shit. Hold on. One quick. more, yeah, one more. All right, perfect. Okay, good. You hear me? I'm here. All right. Okay. Cool. Um. Yeah. So I mean, no, yeah. I was just trying to add whack, and um. I, I guess whack has um, six hundred and loose a part of the exposures. I mean, f for me, I think the the good conversation we could have a part of this. Well, number one, I think I always wanted to have a conversation. I didn't know you were interested. I, I told Vlad and Adam this. No, I told Vlad this. I said, I never knew Brick Baby was that connected or as interested till you interviewed him because a lot of times on no jumper you're giving your opinion on shit i don't know your background and what yeah. vlad does really good is vlad gonna give the background of everything and then when i seen you talking about other things based on your experience and based on where you were at i was like oh shit damn i actually that's am how my voice even even kind of even holds any type of matter yeah because like you know, the things that Big U and Wack and all them went through as far as the industry being young and just running around. And it just happened to be like these rooms I was entering, they end up being like super big rappers. Nobody thought that Thug, when he was missing teeth and in the trenches every day, nobody thought he was going to. They, we just was rocking out and the movement just end up being so crazy that really between him and Kid Ink, and big the 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 introduction through BMF Big Beach and all that stuff when I first got there that kind of like pushed me into these rooms to where like when anything great was going on I was able to be there and I just made it my you know what I'm saying I took I I, I took the floor every time I hit one of them rooms I ain't miss opportunity <laughs> no, no no I completely get it and I I know like you were really like you you were to fly on the wall in mad photos and mad situations hey let me ask you a question because and I asked I asked it while Luce and, and, and um six hundred was on but like e even like even your issue with whack which you say it's not that personal um it, it feels like people go at you because big U doesn't talk right like we don't see big yeah. U like online. Yeah. Do you feel like these guys who go at you, like even Wack, do you feel like they really want to go at Big U, but like you're the next best option? Yeah, that's exactly. It, 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 it's nothing. That's the only thing it could be. Because it's like I don't really have any smoke. I don't really know them. They know him. You get what I'm saying? And when they caught on that I ain't just going to let you talk bad about him because I was raised by him. They kind of like poke at the bear. Like they know like certain stuff. I'm not going to let you run with that narrative because I know how easy the world is. Like, you know, if they hear it with no debate or no rebuttal, then it's true. So it's like certain stuff. I can't let you drag my boy name in the dirt. I ain't here to fight nobody else's battles. Yeah. Yo, why you and Wack never met or even sat down ever? Well, we was both going to have a sit down. Um, the way he came around my area was through uh, 
Big U, and he's beefing with Big U. So my whole thing was trying to get to like a medium, let them find a middle ground. You get what I'm saying? And then uh, hop on with them. But I was even willing to hop on with them before they got fully to a medium because I had both had them agreeing. And, and, and by the way, I, I uh, added back whack, but I only added whack. So. Okay. It's, 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 yeah, I, and with, with, with them almost agreeing on a conversation to settle things, and I think the Black Sam interview came out, and we took a couple steps back. Would you say so, White? So it, it, this is the thing, right? And I said this the other day. It'll probably come out tomorrow. I think you be forgetting because you need to start doing your own personal therapy. I had to do it. I challenge you to start stop reframing. Refrain from the on six oh on hood dead homies on there because when you can do that, then you can mentally tell yourself I'm on a podcast and you won't slip and be pulling shit in from over there that shouldn't be over there. And this is yeah. no troll. This is, no, I, I swear to God, tomorrow when he come out, you're going to see, I said it to you, right? Right? So what I'm saying is, you going to start talking, but I think you be, and see, your shit more dangerous because your shit be live. My shit yeah. be recorded. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So once you utter something, it's gone. Right? Mm. And I yeah. think you 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 know you come from something and then you over here and it's like they fuck with you because you authentically from the streets and you on no jumper but some of that shit you is too authentic for no jumper mm. no, I agree and, I agree in certain and, instances though but everybody you know like you I got said, better I don't act in my recent uh, content you ain't really seen me slipping like that before you get yeah, because you, didn't didn't pipe down, you ain't you That's ain't been up here lit. You That's ain't been up there yeah, you ain't been up there as lit. You ain't been as yeah, lit up yeah, here. Yeah. yeah, I had to take back off of everything. I don't sit lean like that no more. I have to do yeah, that because time. nigga, you'll get up the next day. day. You'll get up the next day. And the blog's going crazy, and you scratching your head like, what the Trying fuck? to figure out what the fuck I said. <laughs> and, and then it come on. Hey. Wait, why the fuck did I just fall off again? Am, am I doing that? I think I'm clicking on too many shit. Yeah, that's me. Bro, this phone is getting so much calls, it's like burning up. Uh, oh my God, who are these people? Yo, <laughs> yo, there's like three girls who just sent me a random nude. Like, yo, first of all, ain't no girls watching this. So why y'all send me y'all send me y'all girlfriend's vagina, bro? Like, chill out, chill out, bro. Don't offer your girl up for the content, bro. Hold on, give me one second. Uh, I just got a call back. God damn it. It's all good. Yo, ch chat, I think I've leaked people's numbers before, too. So, it, 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 I don't, you know, I don't trip. I, I've, yeah, I remember, like, when I used to, like, have girls come on the stream, I would, like, leak their number, too, like, accidentally, right? So, I don't be tripping through all that shit. All right. Let me get him back on. Yeah, no. my bad. I, I think that it keeps cutting off. I don't know if I, because I'm playing with the phone. But anyway, hold on. Let me, let me add whack again. Up my add whack. Do that. All right. Uh, okay, okay. All right, y'all uh, both back on. Whack, you here? Whack, you here? Wait, is, is whack on? Uh -huh. I don't know if you're on here. You can hear me, though? Okay. Right. Now you can hear me. me talk. Whack, I'm no. adding you to the call. I'm adding you to the call. My bad. This shit must have dropped. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. Yeah, all right. Bet. 
and, 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 and but see with you and loose you and 600 didn't had your own relationship like all oh, you you be bring you be on some crazy shit because one minute Good. No, nah, that's too. my boy. He gotta, he gotta stop doing that with the hood, bro. He gotta do that. Talk to me on the phone about that. That ain't never supposed to be on the stream. Nothing. You and loose then how to understand. Yeah, I'm calling this phone. I'm sorry. The person you were trying to reach has a voicemail box that has not been set up yet. <laughs> and we got a whole another understanding, right? But at the end I'm of the day, me, you and him was on the phone. Listen. We had an understanding that, nigga, you kind of just put it. I didn't feel like arguing with you that day. I got off the phone and text Adam like I No, we weren't it. arguing that day. Nigga. No, but I didn't no. even want to turn it that way, gang. I ain't even going to go back and forth. No, I feel like it was Kevin. I don't feel like I didn't fit the program. But, Brick, you, me, and Luce was on the phone, and you and Luce engaged in your own conversation. Right? And no, I, I wasn't tripping. Shit, I right, fuck it. I right. had a conversation. And then we sit fifteen minutes beforehand, you pulled out. But you, you having to understand I be thinking brick. I'm not gonna think. talk about it on stream. Wait, 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 right? wait, wait, whack, whack. <laughs> whack, 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 whack. Can we get one thing accomplished? It feels like you're coming around to the point that Maybe Brick isn't co-conspirator for in the Dirk case. M nah, I don't know what the fuck Brick is. Cause Brick, Brick, I don't know what the fuck Brick is. I don't know what the fuck that is because nigga, they kept, they came for a search warrant to get Brick's phone. Bro, you can build whatever narrative you want to build. Bro, you just said it. Yo, it was just what I'm saying is it, they didn't come to get one thing. Anytime that you come on, yeah. wait, 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 hold on. The, the only there, thing, any, anytime you get arrested, the police are gonna take your phone, and you, and depending on what type of case you get, they're gonna use it as evidence, so they can go through any all your text messages and screen all your shit. They are gonna do that. And by the way, and by the way, whack. Uh, Brick said that um, they didn't ask him any questions about anything related to to Lil Pob or Dirk or or. Or anything with Quando at all? No, he said they would. They came over there because the shit it was going on on social media. Mm. That's what he said. Yeah, it's they said like they've been on you since March. They've been on you since March. And you okay. made that statement in February about nigga who did the slide and all that old shit. Hey, hey by the way, Brick, I'm, I'm asking you a question, like a genuine question. Are, are you know? I think you know you have fans listen to all of this, trying to like figure out what's what. Are you a little, a little bit apprehensive in answering it? Because you're like, man, I feel like this nigga's trying to jam me up more than just trying to clear it up. That's why you're probably like uh -oh. not, not coming oh, forward. Nah, he ain't trying to clear nothing up. He's having a conversation. He's building the narrative. He's never on your side. He's building it up to make his shit look better. So I'm just really no, no, wait, wait. I don't got nothing to do with this shit. Listen, I'm just engaged. I know Lil Durk. I know Lil Durk. I know Lil that's what I'm doing right now. I, I ain't gonna lie to you. I know what I'm gonna speak on and what I'm not gonna speak on at this point. So it's just like anything around. But what did you speak on when they, they when they when they asked you about? When I know you asked them why you why y'all want my shit. I know you, nigga. No, I didn't. Why would I? Why would I ask them? Why would they? They got it. It's already booked in the evidence. You don't know that they got well, it. You didn't ask you, no question. No, 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 no. Hold on. Let me finish. You wouldn't know until you checking out of the county or wherever you bail out from. My 77th Street in my, in, in, my, uh, in my situation, it was 77th Street. I checked out. They didn't give me my cell phone. And I already know the drill. They did that in the case in 2012. They did it in the case in 2010. So they did it in They didn't take my phone several times. I know they so, keep my phone. So, Brick, you telling me you didn't ask them no questions? I was at LAPD. It was, well, who I'm going to talk to, that clerk lady at the front that's going to tell you, wait, until the, the detective come out? Hey, by the way, did you have a lawyer? You know your lawyer could... Hold on. No, hold I'm on, not going to... Listen, hey, I've been hold in jail on, so bro. many times, I'm not even finna ask for the phone. Anything that they got, they got, and I'm not finna ask about it, bro. If we not finna make no fuss over $200. Hold on, go Brick, buy me Brick, hold on. Act, 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 act. Hold on, Brick. Are you telling me 
you didn't ask them any questions and you didn't answer no questions when they took you in custody on June 23rd, 2020. I didn't say I didn't answer no questions. You just want to keep building the doctor. Nigga, on six months. Nigga, I, I didn't. know nigga, you, you said, did I ask about my phone, bro? You said, did I did I ask about my phone? No, I did not. They gave you a Never reason why they arrested you, right? Phone. They gave you a reason why they arrested you, right? Right? They I, they never gave me a reason that they arrested me until I was getting booked in to 77th Street, and they said, this is what you fighting, and this is your bill, brother. You don't, you don't remember saying that they watched 600 videos, so you had the yeah, conversation? Yeah, they said that. Okay. But they didn't never right. tell me what I was arrested for until I was already booked. So what is the conversation? When I got had? my pink receipt, it said I was I was booked for firearms. And my, it gave me a court date and all that. But that ain't why they... I mean, they came. They might have came, but they originally came for a reason. I mean, and if you, you got, know, if you know, because you be having all the insight, then keep on going through your intel, bro, because you okay. know all what about I'm saying that again. I don't even know. I keep what telling you that they don't. Brick. If you know, that means that you know the people. Brick. Brick, no. What I'm saying is this, Brick. Right? Huh? Nice try. <laughs> you said that they told you... They watched 600 videos, and you said because they told you that, you had the conversation. Did you not? With 600, right? No, with the police. No, I didn't say because they told you. The police you. didn't tell you they the watched police 600 said, videos? said, do you know 600, Mr. Lovejoy? I said, we here to talk about Zaire Mitchell. They said, well, he gives us a tour around the neighborhood every morning. That's how we know where the shit's at. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. wait, 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 by the way, Brick, so if there is an interrogation video that comes out later or some type of audio recording of that conversation. Oh, it's coming. That's why I don't let me do my work, act. Eh? Oh, so okay. you telling me, Brick. Oh, all right. You telling me right now, Brick, oh, on rolling 60 crit. Oh, man. <laughs> that's all you said in that interrogation room? As long as you can. Now, be careful, you, my nigga. Don't be careful. Wax go get the tape, man. nigga. That's Be the careful. Homies, go get the tape, that nigga. What is you I'm just about? asking you. If you got the tape, drop it. You ain't hold no. nothing like that. I don't you think so. Bull I'm bull done bull shit. You got if you got that kind of. Are you telling me I'm on rolling sixty crib? Now, that's you all you say. My check versus your check at no jumper. You got an uh, interrogation tape for me. Listen, on rolling sixty crib. That's what you said. Listen to what yeah, I'm trying oh, to tell you. Yeah. I'm done talking. You just alluded to a tape. Oh. Bring the tape. Hold on. That's what we going to do. On, Drop bro. that. Drop that. Hold on, bro. I Drop that. Listen. Nigga, look how good I'm looking in that motherfucker. Hold on. Fuck <laughs> is you talking about? That, that, that's him yeah, in this yeah. arrest framework. Okay, well, hold on. Watch this. 600. What did this man tell you? <laughs> You that keep talking to so, a nigga that's a that bum. I'm getting on. Hey, act with 600, get that off the phone. I'm, talk. I'm about to talk shoot up. To I'm going to let him talk. I'm that muting up. Don't run. Talking. They telling him that they watching all my videos. And I give him a tour of the hood every day. He said the feds told him that. He ain't said I'm the LAPD. I just admit, I just told you that. So I don't even know what how. Are we I talking about here? What are we talking about here? What are we talking about here? I just, I just said that. What are we talking about? When has it been? When has it been a bad so thing to catch a case? Bed. I'm a street nigga. I caught a case. What are you talking about? When is it? You you niggas just wait, 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 hold on, hold on. wait, 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 Informant or like because that's the, we don't know that's the fact. We that's don't the thing. we don't have the facts. But he sat down with them people, and we don't know what he said. Man, listen, nigga, any nigga. But he said he said something. Hey, 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 guess what? It's the niggas like you that act like they don't have conversations with niggas, but got sealed paperwork that niggas still ain't seen, nigga. My Stop. nigga, I cleared them sealed paperwork. Work. It don't, I, it, 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 I, I got didn't it. see, nigga. Like I, I said, nigga, it's it's all on the internet. You don't, you I will send it to on. you. I cleared it. I went and got it myself. All it's right. all on the internet. All, all right. of it. Everything else. Everything else. Like I said. Yo, Wack, I ain't going to lie to you, man. I got to say, whatever you pay, 
paying, uh, no, not, not whack. I mean, Adam, whatever you paying whack and paying brick, thank y'all. <laughs> Thank you. You go through whatever you want to go through, nigga. My name public, nigga. I'm, uh, I'm standing on that. I don't really care what a nigga listen, say. Brick, you get listen, wait, Brick, Brick said he didn't answer no questions about ain't anybody ever, other than Zaire. Ain't nobody ever went to jail. Yo, who's Zaire like, Williams? Who's Zaire Will, 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 Williams? Who's that? Who? Zaire something? Who's that? Mitchell? Yeah, who's that? That's me. Oh, so you said you didn't answer no question about no other person. I did not say that. I did not say that. Nigga, I said that nigga, I never went into conversation about no other person. I, I that's like a gray area. So so you so so you mentioned what other I'm people. Is, you... If they ask me a question, do I know this person? Or da, 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 oh, okay. nah, I don't know this person. So I answered the question. So you, I can't tell you that I didn't answer the question. You get what I'm trying to tell you? Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right, now I'm, I understand. Yeah, I don't want it because nigga, we being technical, technical right now. Mm, okay, no, no, I get it, I get it. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So if y'all got, it's my thing. Y'all got some content to drop about that? Drop it, cause I know I'm in agreement with everything I got going on. Hmm. Now, it, well, I think Wack fell off the call. Well. Uh, yo, I'm gonna be honest with you. Half halfway a little bit, I, I feel I feel a little bit bad. Hold on, hold on. I feel a little yeah. bad for you because I'm like yo, I, I I feel like they don't fuck, they all don't fuck with Big U, and and you're the Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Oh, first of all, he don't want to have that conversation because you know that's some gym, that's some other shit. I know he don't want to talk about that, right? So Big U ain't got nothing to do with Brick Baby. Yeah, yeah, but, but whack, 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 exactly. whack, whack. Do you really yeah, think? Do Brick wait, wait, whack. Do you really think that Brick Baby is like, you know, cooperating? I think that Brick Baby ass went down there and then and, and, and instead of telling him I plead the fifth, I think he, I think he heard him out. I think he asked some questions. Wait, whack. You're smart, so I'm gonna ask you the question directly. We know that and I got it. We we know the feds the feds will cross collateralize to get the content not content to get the evidence they need. Do you think they they tap brick on the shoulder based on what they had on him to probably get some info? I'm gonna tell you why I'm saying that. He said what he said in February. Then he turned around and said they told him they've been on him since March. Right after. Hey, right, hey, right. hey. Hey, we gonna have 1090 look up how many people in Los Angeles get DA rejects from guns a year. That's what we gonna no, do because no, everybody no, thinks no. that that like we go we go we go look that up. That is a okay. common practice. If they don't have the right, like if they don't have you all the way to the T, because out here the way that you can fight a gun that wasn't in my possession. There's no reason of that DA picking up right post COVID, picking up a gun case where they don't have enough evidence to fully have me go take the deal. And have you went to court them. already, nigga. And they, it was a DA reject. They did not pick up the case, right? Okay, but you said you went okay, to court. Okay, so you I'm to you. go out here. You, you got to know. I know I, how I go. to jail. This you, is my first bro. time ever being out of jail for four years, nigga, since I was 18. You this is my first time. You got arrested June 23rd, 2023. You went to court Bro, July. All right, all right, you going back in over the same shit. Yeah, you went I to did. court July. Yeah, I went to July. Court day, did they ask you how did you plead guilty and not guilty? If you, if the D, if I made it yes that far, no. I wouldn't have a DA reject. Brother, the DA I, reject means he rejected to, to accept July, the case. It means he rejected to accept the case. When you went to court of July, we were there of. Because eight just, months ago, you just real. said you mm -hmm. still had court on There's nothing did else not? to talk about about that one, bro. You did you not just say eight months ago, you, you still had good. court on it? Hey, 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 hold on, hold on. All right, wait, 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 wait. I break, 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 break. I went to Compton Court, niggas. I break, break, break. Like I said, I'll ask you this question. I'll ask you this question. He won't answer the question. So, well, I'll ask him a separate question. So, so whatever case, I don't really care about it, but, but, but is it completely, is it adjudicated? Is it dismissed? Is it finalized? Listen, in, in Los Angeles, if they don't file within a year and above, 
the case is automatically thrown. AK 47s are illegal in the state of California. You're so jealous of nigga on the streets without telling. God damn. Oh, you want wait, a nigga wait. to go to jail? What are you talking about? Put a case on the nigga. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait. wait. You yeah, yo, whack, whack, whack. 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 whack, whack. It appears that what Brick. Yo, whack. It appears Brick Baby is saying. Brick Baby is trying to say that. He feels like so. There's a thing called DA reject where they don't pick it up. He's saying that he feels that DA you're you're upset act. that he's not locked up. Wait, whack. Are no, you upset what I'm he's not locked is up? This. Act, act, stop. He got arrested June twenty third, twenty twenty three. They, hey, right? hey, hey, act. They he's not going, telling you that the top don't got July. no footage in it, nigga. It ain't found it, in it my don't wall. Matter. Oh, people hey, at hey. house. Wait, no wait, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, whack, whack, whack. He's giving some details. Won't let me wait, talk. wait, wait, hold on, whack. He's Listen. giving some details. He said the gun wasn't found in his house. It had no bullets in it. it Go ahead. But, but act, act. It's different. Come on, this brother. This particular firearm is illegal in our state. It ain't a nine. It ain't a 40. Are you a cop? Are you a cop? This is the law. Like, do you want them to refine? Google AK-47 in California. Google it. Yeah, like, you, you. Google it. They are not DA reset to no pay, nigga. What do you mean? We just having a conversation. Why do you want a nigga to go to jail so bad? What the fuck is wrong with you? I want you to tell us the truth. I thought you was Hollywood a nigga. cracker. Oh, look. Hell, I'm the truth. I'm sitting with you, piss. Nigga, like, I know. Wait, wait, wait. Right, 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 hold on. That's where we at right now. All right, all right. So, oh, whack, whack. Side. What's your theory? What's your theory? The truth. What's your theory, Wack? What's your theory? I hear what you're saying. This is my theory. And by the way, hold on. Before you say that, he said it, what he hold said on. Wait, Wack, Before he you said that, I'm going to read what it says. Before you, before, before you say that, I'm, I'm going to read this. It, it says, because the AK-47, as everybody should know, is an assault rifle, it, it's a highly it's a highly um, illegal gun when it comes to California. It's not in just, California. It, 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 it's, it's definitely just not seen as... In California. They are not rejecting no fucking case. Hey, 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 hey. They walk inside the studio right now. It's three niggas in that motherfucker, bro. On the dead homies, nigga. They go to some nigga that ain't loaded. They put together or nothing, bro. Oh, hood. And they take one nigga to jail, nigga. How can they for sure say that that's they one person? They put it on you. Bro? You gonna fight what it. What the fuck are you talking about? You're going to fight the case. Okay, and then what, you bro? You do not if go to court no so who want to go there with that? To go to court they one July. DA want to see my lawyer with that case. They one DA. Come on, bro. Let's get real. Like and I'm not even finna. It's not. I'm not even finna talk Where's about it anymore, bro. Where's the paperwork? Bro, that's over with. You just want hey, to keep talking about me. I'm not talking about that. Wait, wait. Nigga, all right, hold on. Give up the paperwork, God. Nigga, give up the work. I, all right, you gotta provide the work. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Hey, oh, wait, wait, wait. So, Brick I, Baby, I was gonna get it on Monday. We already talked, brother. Wait, 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 Brick Baby. And is you there... just said eight months ago you had court. You said you was gonna go to court and then let us know. Now, if it got DNA, it's July 2023. What you about? What you saying? Is what you said. You said it when you were crying. You were talking about you got kill squad outside. You said in that, oh no, jumper! You said it's not me. That you was—I don't know how wacky you know what you know it. I don't know what you're talking about me and all that shit that you mad that I'm not in jail for. No, nigga, you don't identify OPF as the shooter. Academics, you want to be in We see that. Okay, wait, 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 wait. You believe that? Wait, we got you. Think you put niggas in jail? Wait, 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 wait. Hey, 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 enjoy your stream, bro. Hey, you put this is... in jail. All right, cool. Jail. That's cool. When the last time you receipt. talked some shit and, and, and it was the real? Nigga. Where's your bell receipt? Wait, wait, hold on. Yo, yo, so break, break. I've been posting the bell receipt. Go look at my, go look at my motherfucking previous videos. I've been posted that bell receipt, nigga. Crazy. Yo, where, yo, where is that? Yo, break. Hey, yeah, Why right, do you nigga, think Wack is saying this? I didn't post, I didn't post that pink slip a million times, nigga. Yo, brick. Like, why do you think that Wack is saying this? What, what do you think Wack's angle is? Because he's saying it's everywhere. Wack wants no, me to go to jail, nigga. Yeah, what? Nigga, I'm to the point to. If I'm a snitch, it'll come out. I'm done talking about it, right? Wack won't be in jail. If I'm a snitch, no, you put this, niggas this in jail. This case right here you is the one that's going to be the one. 
If I'm a snitch, I'm going to be all in the paperwork. I'm going to be on the stand. You this is going to be the one. Jail. I put niggas in jail. This is going to be the one I can't hide from. Hey, by the way, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Break, 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 break. But let me ask you. Wait, hold on. Whack, whack, one second. Wait, one second. One second. Whack. No, I mean brick. Um, so you said there is some paperwork. I guess why I couldn't get do, do you have that paperwork? By the way, we're in front of thirty five thousand people. Fuck I feel bro, like we, we're gonna figure something out of out of this, right? So d do you have they some said, paper do, is there paperwork that I got where? Or what? No, 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 I mean paperwork that kind of no no yeah, paperwork that says First and foremost, like I said, now you can look up the process online while you got thirty five thousand okay. people right, and see what the process of a DA reject is. Because at this point, I know that if they don't file, you went I to called court. in. I, hold on, let me finish. I called in a year and a month afterwards and seen if they had any court dates scheduled for me or if I had any warrants. They told me that it was clear. So in my case, it's clear. You get what I'm saying? Now, if they got a piece of paper going in, go ahead and oh. look it up because I don't know if they issue a piece of paper. But I can get my piece of paper. California. I go oh, get my piece of paper. Tell you I, mean, I, 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 I don't know how to go do this. As long as you want it, they're not going to give you a court date. You're mad because you, went you to court are, in July. You want a nigga in jail, you come Did you go to court in July? Yeah. Did you plead guilty or not guilty? You don't go in right? front of the judge if the DA. Look up what a DA reject is. Why are we they didn't reject about this in July? July. Just look up what a DA they did not reject it in July. Hold on. You okay, 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 okay. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So I I'm going to read exactly what it says. It says, in California, district attorney, a DA, uh, a DA reject means that a prosecutor has decided not to file criminal charges against a defendant. This can happen for a number of reasons, including insufficient evidence to convict the defendant. A DA reject doesn't mean necessarily the case is dismissed. Here's some other things to know about criminal charges in California. There you the, go. the statute of limitations for criminal charges in California is usually one year for misdemeanors and three years for felonies. However, there are exceptions there for more serious crimes like rape or murder, which have no statute of limitations. Uh, AK-47 is a felony. Did you file a 1381 or a 1382? Bro, no. I don't got to file nothing if the case never been filed. Wait, 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 hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Whack, 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 whack. Ain't no nigga walking around that got arrested and bailed out. You too old to understand. Hey, right. Yo, he to bail out, you ain't going to jail. And you went to court in July. What did you do with it? What are you talking listen, about? Listen, Brody, you... Haven't been to jail in years, bro. You can't tell me about the judicial system right now. Jail ain't tell me about the judicial system bro. I'm not just the average nigga, bro. You can't just talk to me. I'm really can't that you want to be like a blue face. And all my other artists. I think going to jail, cool. Cool. You can hold on, hold on. That's wait, wait, hold on. Hey, hey, by the way, by the way, by the way, I'm, 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 by the way, I'm about? trying to be unbiased, and, and I'm gonna tell you what I think from based based on what I read. And I don't think either y'all are, 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 are wrong in in what y'all are trying to purport, right? So, no, no, I agree. No, I hear what you're saying, but if the DA didn't, if the DA picked it up, we would have known. They haven't picked it up for whatever reason. Now, I do think if Brick is. They're going to leave him alone. Yeah, but that's, that's speculation, fact. though. Like, like, like we need to go get that DA reject paperwork. Exactly. No, there ain't no speculation. This is regulation. Listen, if this is relations. Yeah, man. Hey, listen, man. I know what I'm talking about. It ain't nothing else to talk about. about you know, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. All right, I'm going to give some more. I'm gonna, wait, 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 wait. I'm going to give some more information. I, I think this is where it, it goes on to Brick and if Brick had an attorney at that time. So it says a D, DA reject is when a district attorney in California declines to file a charge um, against the, uh, the defendant due to insufficient evidence or other reasons. A DA reject could... Also occur when a felony charge is reduced to a misdemeanor or lesser charge. A DA reject can be communicated by a detective, court liaison officer, or court clerk, or district or deputy district attorney. If the original charge was a felony, the copy of the district attorney charge evaluation worksheet should be obtained and attached to court papers. Um, there it go. So, there it go. We gotta go get that. 
Hold on, no. All right, wait, wait. Hold on, no. No, fuck that act. Hold on. Now listen. Wait, wait, wait. I got one more thing to read. Wait, wait. Just give me one second. One more second. So, and, and, and th again, this is y'all can talk after this. It says to encourage a DA to not file charges, criminal defense attorneys can send a DA reject request or letter of representation to the prosecutor. This this letter um, informs the prosecutor that the suspect uh, has retained uh, private defense, which means that there might there should be some paperwork or some communication that says. We're rejected. That says that it's for sure. If it's 16 yes. by 15, I ain't been to court. Got no paperwork. You keep okay. saying I ain't been to court. I wait for Hold on. July. No, there's no this. other court me, date. What are we talking let me about? You're just this talking. Hold you're on. just talking. Hold on. No. Let me tell you what else. Hey, you're talking. Let me tell you what else. Hey, it's right. public record. No call down the cops and call out the bag in the file, nigga. That's no, what you really no, want to no, do. Go do it, nigga. Bag Let me tell you what else. Bag Go bag Don't bag him. Nigga, you don't have to Hey, if we got a phone, why are you talking about on live flashing guns? Why are you that comfortable, nigga? You did that on your life. That never happened, Wax. On your fucking life. Why are you that comfortable with an OPK case, nigga? You did that shit. No, you did it, stupid. I'm not no cop. Your dumbass flashed the burner, and you out on bail for a thing that you claim is a reject, but you ain't got no paperwork. You know why you that comfortable? Because you got to get out of jail free card, nigga. Did you not? You did it. I didn't do it. You did it, nigga. This ain't telling. You showed the world you driving around with a burner, putting up on a nigga crib, nigga. But yet you got a K case with no fucking dispensal paperwork, and you out on bail, and you that comfortable because you the police, nigga. That's a fact. Hey, I, I I think he hung. I don't know if he meant to hung up, but uh, yeah, he, you know why? Because I saved that act. This nigga was driving around about three, four months ago with a flash and a pistol, smoking weed. But yet, you got an AK forty seven case, nigga, that you ain't been to court on. Get the fuck out of here. Even if a nigga got a DA reject, he ain't that comfortable to do that. And he ain't got no DA reject with an illegal assault rifle in the state of California and you a fucking felon. Get yo, 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 the fuck wax, out of here. Right, so, so I'm going to play a little bit of Devil's Act. I, I feel like he was saying that his lawyer, whoever probably told me, yo, they're not going to pick it up. But they still could pick it up. That's why he don't want to talk paperwork. about it. Yeah, well, no, no, hold on, no, 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 hold on, I, wait, 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 hold on. I don't think it's a DA reject. They just has, they haven't picked it up yet. Like, if it was a DA, DA reject, as you oh, said, act, it, it would be paperwork. If you know you got a pending AK forty seven case, right? Yeah. And you a felon, right? Yeah. Are you comfortable or uncomfortable in the world? Are you going to be pulling out guns on fucking IG live, flashing them, what? driving around? This, this yeah, is why niggas know, can't bro. beef with you, man. I ain't gonna lie. The only you. thing <laughs> make a nigga do that is if you. Wait, why my phone just like disconnect? Now I'm gonna get both of them back on this bitch. Hold on. Wait a minute. I don't know what's going on. Yo, some of y'all supporters here, you know, I, I love y'all, but y'all definitely fucked up the content slightly. Not gonna lie. Because I keep calling me and I gotta use two phones. I'm calling Brick back. I don't know if Brick want to be on. Let me, let me ask Brick if he want to. Because I don't want to. I, I feel like that's shitty if I'm like ambushing him. I don't want to ambush him. So, um, it. Yo, Brick. All right. All right. Yo, you here? Yeah, I hung up, bro. I, oh, I'm yeah. not doing that. I'm all right, all right. Yeah, yeah, yo, yo. Nah, 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 I just, I just sent it to the stream. Um, hold on. I'm gonna just put my other phone on. So, so this other, I'm, I'm adding my other phone. But, but, yeah. You know, if you don't want me to act, add whack, I, bro, I, I'm not trying to. I'm not here to try to ambush you. I just don't want to argue about that and keep on talking about myself to the point to where it's like, bro, I already told you that it didn't get fired. Act like it didn't happen, bro. Well, you know what I'm saying? Like at the end yeah. of the day, nigga, stop fucking talking about that shit. We here to talk about, nigga, did I tell or not? No, I did not tell. So I didn't tell why you worry about it. all that shit is public record. Just as much as it.
went to court, what date, and all that. I don't know. I go look it up, figure it out. I can show everything, though. No. But I'm not in the rush to prove myself to Wack, who got a whole lot of issues in the streets of not being too much of a trustworthy guy when it comes to the cops. You know what I'm saying? Like, and you know, he says that's a made up narrative, whatever. So I don't even chase that narrative. You don't see me running around talking about that shit as much as everybody else. Yeah, no, 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 I understand that angle too, because, you know, obviously we didn't call to, you know, I know he's going to tie it to, well, if we're going to talk about the Dirk thing in Co Conspirator 4, part of his theory why he thinks you're a Co Conspirator 4 is because you're in trouble with the feds and you got to give him something. So you basically help connect some dots, which that's his theory. Um, like, I'm not here to talk about, like, we don't got 35,000 people on here to talk about whatever case you got, like, you know, respectfully. Um, hope you figure it out. We're not here to talk about it. We, we want to talk about things connected to the Dirk situation. That's and, what I thought we were talking about. Because, man, I yeah. ain't talking about nothing that got nothing to do with me. I know I'm all with They can't wait. As soon as that I do something fucked up, hey, if I fuck up on the stream, they got it, bro. If I fuck up in real life, they going to fry me. So that's why I said when they if they get that and they get some shit like that, they not going to be able to hold on to it, bro. It hey, don't hey, exist, though. Hey, yeah, They've been digging. It don't exist. Hey, I, I wanted to ask you this question. Do you know OTF Jam or no? I don't know how many people in OTF you, you, you knew. You I, I don't know OTF Jam. You ever met yo, you never um, met him, right? I never met him. What year he came home from jail? Um, so it looked like he came around in like 2022. And then it yeah, appears see. that he got locked up in 2023. I've been doing research on him the whole day. Um, he, so is that when? So at what point did he tell the police he'll work in 2023? So, 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 so this is a funny thing. He's incarcerated now. You know how I know he's telling? Number one, the feds got a hold on him. I can't find him nowhere. They, they sent him to the gulag, which is exactly where 6 9 went when he started telling. Like, you can't, when someone's telling in the feds, you can't find him nowhere. Nowhere. Like, you know, they're oh, incarcerated, wow. but you can't find him from public searches. You get what I'm saying? So w w uh, what I'm doing is a like public search. Protective custody for real. Like, yes. You can't even see what prison they at. Exactly. Item type and, shit. and by the way, chat, I, I I have some details. Trust me. You know you know me. I'm always tapping my DMs in. The OTF, o, uh, OTF Jam, he is incarcerated. He reached out to somebody because he is apparently, I don't know if he's just snitching blindly. He don't have a lawyer. He's reached out to a few people for lawyers. But we realize he's incarcerated. I look from the jail. He's made the phone call. I, I won't tell y'all, you know what I mean? Because also I don't want to get raided my damn self. Because I'm I think he's under federal protection. Um, I re I try to look at the jail, and this is verified. He definitely called from a particular jail. He's not listed as an inmate. He's not listed as an oh, inmate. Wow. He has an open. He has an open case. He has an open gun case in Chicago. But he's not in Chicago. That's how you know the feds got him. He has an open oh, wow. case. He has an open gun case. I'm um, in Chicago. That he that 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 pretty much uh, um violated whatever he was out on because you know he came home after 12 years. But he's not in Chicago. The feds got him. I think they flipped him. But again, I, I'm still I'm, I'm still investigating. Uh, I mean, investigating. I'm just looking around to see something's up here because I've never seen. Yo, and by the way, I'm not using, I don't got no special tools. It's just, we know how to, we, hey, if you get locked up for a gun in Milwaukee, whatever that county is, you could go to that county's website and see that person locked up because until sure. they get a bond. This sure. is a situation. He got a case in Illinois, Chicago, but he's somewhere else and look like he's on the move and the feds are moving him around. Which at first I was like, maybe people are just blaming this OTF Jam guy, but it looks like he might be, he, he, he might be in the mix. Where did they get the wire information from? So that's not verified yet. It's not verified that there's somebody with a wire, right? Like it, it's thought, it's thought that someone has a wire, based on some of the things that have been said. The series of events. Yeah, yeah. like 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 the, the, for for example. And by the way, like I have a slight theory that maybe OTF Jam, based on the timeline of him being arrested and him being free, 
in August 19th, 2022, when um, Lil Pop got murdered, he was free. He got caught and he got locked up in 2023. Um, he might be co-conspirator too, which means he would be the shooter. Now, that would make sense, but I don't know yet if he's the shooter. And here's the thing. I thought they named Didi as co-conspirator too. Who? No, no, no. I thought it. Oh, no, no. D- I was reading it wrong then. Yeah, Didi, his last name is Wilson. His na- last oh, okay. name is Wilson. So, uh, I think it's DeAndre Wilson or something like that. That's his full name. Um, by the way, I don't think he's telling. Because if he's telling, Dirk is completely done. Because he's the middleman. He's like to compare to Dolph's case, he's the um he's the he's the Hernandez Govan, right? Where, where he tells them, yo, get the car here, get this, here the guns, go kill him, I'm gonna get y'all paid. But the money not coming from him, so he's the real allegedly. Middle man. Allegedly, I, I'm going off just what the what is being um, reported in the uh, what the feds are saying. So this is federal allegations. But yeah, I doubt that. That's what I said. I don't even. This is this is the whole thing. It's detailed enough, but if it's all hearsay and they put the phones together with the hearsay, then that's a different thing. I don't know. I just feel like Dirk wouldn't be having conversations about bounties and all that. Like, you know what I mean? The for hire shit is like crazy. You get what I'm saying? Like, what if they called in and was like, hey, we trying to get to L.A. on their own type of timing? What, 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 and, th- and Dirk just booked it because he usually pay for their flights everywhere. Hey, by the way, no, no. Hey, so this stream I, I should have titled different. This stream should have been called "How to Get Away with Murder" because I, whether Dirk did it or not, or paid for it or not, I have the ultimate way how Dirk gets out of this, how Dirk beats this entire thing, and everything will be circumstantial. First of all. You do you know when he went to um when he went to LA so he went via private jet he did a podcast that day hey that's why I went to LA I didn't go to LA for a nigga getting killed I went for a podcast I went to do business I was promoting so he has an alibi in that um and and, and he has you know he has reasonable he has a reasonable um you know hey I didn't know like you, you know sometimes you might now you're this big star you got homeboys but. Y'all might share the same beef, but you're not telling them every crime to do, every nigga to shoot. Yeah, he has he, That's what I, he has a reasonable like, like his flying face. Exactly. Now, here here's the only thing that fucks him. Is if somebody says No. If somebody they're gonna have to get on the stand and say, No, Dirk told me this personally. Or they were wearing a wire. But some of the info in the indictment. The feds aren't saying they got Dirk on a text saying, like, like it's the same with the Dolph situation. They don't have Young Jook, or no, not a Big Jook, I mean, Big Jook on recording saying 100000 for Dolph. You know who says it? The shooter. And the shooter, like the shooter who told, um, uh, I forgot his name, Smith, Cornelius That's Smith. Yeah, yeah, the one who told, he said, yo, we put all our phones outside, Big Juke and Hernandez Govan came in and say, "Yo, I got a hundred thousand for Dolph. I got fifty thousand for Key Glock. I got blah blah blah." So that's why they put Juke in there. So without the witnesses, or without whoever who, who we think is co-conspirator too, and this is where every all the co-conspirators become important. So co-conspirator three, we all assume is telling, but you have to think like you work in no jumper. Think of think of co-conspirator three. It, the way I look at it, it's like, you know, I, I ain't trying to dox y'all employees, but like, it's like Laura. That's who, who do y'all book it, right? Laura? Is that is that a person? Yeah, Laura. Okay. Yeah. So she might book a bunch of things like, okay, so and so's coming. I'm going to get this. But that's what I was trying to tell. I, I feel like that was his assistant. And, and, and they going to yes. know that one of those dudes named in the indictment is his assistant. Now, I feel like they are going to get off lightly. No, I now, said that in one of my streams. Hold on. Now, here's the thing, though. Hey, if the feds run down on the assistant, the assistant's going to give up the info saying, oh, yeah, I did use this card. I did book this. But here's the thing. You book shit anyway. As long as you didn't tell the assistant, yo, I'm booking it for the murder. The assistant, of course, is going to give up all the booking stuff. 
But you could then come back around and say, hey, they book for music videos. They book for, we go to LA all the time to meet with labels. Hey, this is a regular booking. This wasn't a booking if for a murder. They got the credit card. They do it. All, all the travel. Details. Exactly. So everywhere. So so, so here's the thing. The credit card. So they they can do that uh, unbeknownst. Like you know what I'm saying? Not knowing. So here's the thing that's important. We need the the person who's going to send um, Dirk to jail is the witness who either talked to him where Dirk is saying. Man, yeah, I got, I got 50 on his head or I got 100 on his head. If that witness doesn't show up for whatever reason, that case becomes weak because there's no text message that the government has shown so far where Dirk is saying, yo, y'all killed that nigga yet? Ain't no text message that said, yo, that shit is done. Ain't no text message that say, yo, yo, meet up with me to get paid. Ain't no text message that say, yo, y'all find him yet? Nothing. The only message that they show is, Yo, yo, don't book no flights under no name associated with me. Now, here's the thing. Or don't book nothing under anything associated with me. Now, here's the thing, which I think is an alibi. And you know this. Jax. When a lot of these rappers and high-profile motherfuckers go to a hotel, they will check in under a fake name because you don't want people knowing you're there. No way. Exactly. So, so that could be, that's the alibi there, I think. So you, the only thing that's going to put Dirk in jail to me is the motherfucker who's gonna say no 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 that's not it ain't no music shit i talked to him on the phone or he got on a three-way or he facetimed me and he told me yo i got 50 for you if you blow that nigga head off exactly and and zoo and zoo said it best they zoo said it best why would they get paid to slide for their day one if everybody is day ones, why do a check need to be involved with getting rid of King Vine? Man, that's just off of GP. Mm. What type of stripes do you get off of getting paid for the shit? Nigga, you get paid, you're supposed to be doing that because you're mad anyway. Now, here's the thing, though. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. The reason why the wire comes in is why you cleared yourself by of being a, of co-conspirator four, right? Yeah. November 6, 2020. They're saying after King Von died, they're saying co-conspirator one, which we know is Dirk, used coded language to Wilson, Dee Dee, co-conspirator two, four, and five. Now, here's the thing about four. Four is supposed to be a non-OTF person, right? That's a yeah. non-OTF person. But apparently he used coded language. Maybe they were in a group chat. Maybe it was whatever, but regardless of what that is, the mere fact that the feds know, like the mere facts the feds know that there was coded language, somebody probably was having having a wire on, or they were recording yeah. a conversation. That's where the wire comes in, because how the For hell sure. if, if 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 this is two years before Lil Pop gets killed, how the hell you know about the conversation planning to kill? Now there's another option, wow, which is incarcerated. Yeah. Well, now there's another option of oh, they were already investigating Dirk and Vaughn, and after the killing, them wiretaps came up with this. But we'll find out. But people think that co-conspirator two, because co-conspirator two is not named, we haven't heard about him being arrested, and he keep being around all the hot conversations that could put niggas in jail. And niggas is in jail. And we don't know who this person is. So that's why we think co-conspirator 2 is and, not only the and, biggest and, snitch, and. but people think that's OTF jam or maybe somebody of the sort. But here's my thing. If Dirk, and by the way, chat, I'm not, you know, I think this would probably be a federal crime. So you know me. I'm not, I'm a law about this. I'm not encouraging for nobody to get hurt. But if co-conspirator 2, for whatever reason, just fell off a cliff, I think this is a weak ass case versus Dirk, but co-conspirator two is gonna be up there like six nine, feet up, eating fries, McDonald's, and he got a point. They not putting co-conspirator. Co-conspirator two could be in jail because I think he's in jail. They feel like they feel like he got so much money that even if they put him somewhere somewhere else, that they still get with his program. So they probably just housing him in jail until the shit over with. Yeah, but here's the thing. 
He might be in like a halfway house program, Yo, but you know, the you know where he at, so I can't say where he might be because you just don't want to say where he at. Well, 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 well that's if it's, that's OTF Jam, right? But here's the thing. Yeah. Cold conspirator, like so. So, chat. Remember, remember, I said I was gonna name the stream "How to Get Away with Murder for Hire." Well, if again, again, I'm not wishing nothing to happen to nobody. But if Dirk, if, if for whatever reason, Cold conspirator two called COVID and was not able to show up for the trial, the case for the feds would be weakened. Because he's the person who's going to corroborate. I don't think Kevon Grant, which is OTF Vonnie, I don't think he's the guy. Because, you know, you know, I don't think he's a guy. They don't know where the guns came from. Did it come from Miami on a private jet? Or did it come from some local niggas in L.A.? The mere fact that they don't know that, co-conspirator Ford, uh, co no, not co-conspirator, I mean, Kevon Grant, who flew on the plane, who gave niggas the guns? Because co-conspirator 2 said he got the gun from Kavon Grant. They don't know where the guns came from, so Kavon is not the is not the snitch. Um, Wait, you said co-conspirator 2 said that they... Co-conspirator 2 is a shooter. He got the gun put in his hand by some uh, a nigga named Kavon Grant, OTF Vani. What I'm saying is that Kavon Grant ain't the snitch. He ain't fold. Because we don't know where the guns like there's nothing that tells you how they got the guns. And he's the one oh, with the okay. guns. So he's solid. You know he's solid. The one that's not solid is co-conspirator two. He did the shooting and clearly he's he was also involved in conversations to put Dirk directly involved with this. And that's the person, the only person in this case. That I feel like if co-conspirator two wasn't here or could not show up to trial, I think Dirk could take this to trial and possibly beat it. Now, obviously, yeah, he's the only one. You make it sense like a mother because he's the only one to every sentence. Yeah, yo, he's the every one. Every situation, he's there. November 6, 2020. He's in the conversation. That, can't, that might not be Jam, though, because Jam didn't touch down till 2022. Ooh. Hey, hey. I'm you using your brain. Yeah. Now, I was, if I was home, I mean, he definitely was home. Okay. So if OTF, J by the way, I agree. I don't think that OTF Jam is co-conspirator too. I think he could be co-conspirator five. Well, actually, no, five, five is in the same thing. This OTF Jam thing, I'm going to be honest with you, might be, it's called like a, that's a send off. I, I think that's a send off. Now, you think it's a it, send -off? yeah. Now, is is Jam snitching on some other shit? Probably, right? Probably. But this situation right here, there is a few other names that I feel like we don't know. But whoever two is, I'm trust me. And, and by the way, chat. If you, it took me four hours to find OTF Jam. Chat, I, I'll, I'll put it up on the screen. Remember I told you I was looking for his real name? Ain't it Curse or something? Nah, his name is Casey Hester. Okay? Casey Hester, Chicago. If you oh, Google wow. that, you're going to see the, the mug shot. This when he was locked up. It, it's, this is 5, which is um May 3rd, 2023. Chat, we click on this. We're going to see the charges. The charges is aggravated assault. Um... I think this is a, 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 a weapon charge. Um, and there was also another warrant. So this is 2023, right? By the way, I looked I looked in Chicago. Both cases are still open, but he's not he's not in Chicago. So he was locked up in Chicago. We don't know about bail. I got somebody going. Uh, the, the weird thing with Cook County, um, it, it doesn't really give you all the access online. You got to have somebody go down to the court. They have kiosks that you could um, put some shit in. We're going to figure that out, but he's not, I know for a fact he's not in Illinois. I won't tell you exactly where he's at. Um, it's interesting because where he's at, I looked up their list of inmates. He's not listed. That's odd. It, like, I remember when 6 9 was locked up and he called, that nigga was like, it was like he was calling from, like, Mars. You know what I mean? Like, he knew they just disappeared him off the map real quick. So, yeah. 
Um, they know how to play tricky when they need to. This the feds. This ain't this ain't the state. They don't. They give a fuck about their witness. They finna do everything to protect that witness. Yeah, yeah. No, of like course. That, it, 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 the only way that they even gonna get him slimed out is if they could get their hands on another rat that's over there that's pushing the code law. Hey, I believe, <laughs> I believe there's at least. At least four or five people who are cooperating, and I believe there's at least ten people who have taken proffers. For example, I I, I don't believe, um, I mean, I, I, people might call uh, co-conspirator three a rat, but I think that's a civilian. What they, what I think they did to that person, all you got to do with a civilian, like if, if you catch a nigga like me, you don't got to do much, you just scare him, be like, yo, we about to charge you with all this. Uh, hell now, nah, nigga, I only book flights and I do this. Okay, give me your phone. Let me look through all that. Give me, give me the login for blah blah blah, and and we will do this as a proffer. We don't charge you, right? They already know that. Or they came shit. with, or they came with enough info to get the grand jury to issue a fucking warrant of Dirk's iCloud too, because somebody said something was retained from the iCloud. So that's the only way they was gonna be able to do that. Oh yeah, no, no, they got onto Dirk's iCloud later too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they, okay. They, they, they got Dirk's number from this Booker, but I think the Booker is not charged because there's um, even though it said co-conspirator three. Um, this person, I don't believe that they believe that this guy was booking flights for murders. They thought there was just booking flights for Dirk, but they scared him enough, did a proffer, got all the shit. Uh, they're going to leave them as co-conspirator three, but now they get to get into Dirk shit. So now they got Dirk. I don't think we're going to see co-conspirator three at all because they're just an assistant. Co-conspirator two, that's a shooter. We're so going to see. Wait, 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 wait. I thought that. Co-conspirator three was the one that hopped on the jet and met them in LA too. Mm -mm. Okay, I'm gonna break everybody down for you real quick. And by the way, chat, you know we've gone over this a lot, but you know it's good for y'all to also remember this. Yeah, I'm gonna lie, and I ain't gonna lie. This might be a little federal, but like it's not federal because I'm only going, I'm going off the indictment. It's like I'm, I'm doing extra shit because I got notes. <laughs> let, let me give you the, the rundown. Co-conspirator one, this before I knew it was Dirk. That was the boss. He puts bounties on, on people's heads, so he puts the hits out. Now we find out it's Dirk, okay? Co-conspirator two. By the way, the chat, let me put this on the screen now y'all can see it. Remember, I took notes while we were going through all this shit. Okay. Co yeah, that's federal act. You got notes on everybody. You didn't build no, 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 no. Yeah, but, but it's notes from the no, 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 but it's notes from the no, it's notes from the indictment. Because here's the thing. No, I know. No, no, no. All from information that you retained from them. But I'm just saying. I, that, no, that, and, and you got to remember, too. we're gonna find out this in court. But like, like we live in this society where we can't wait to court. We want to find out who's who right now. You know, you know the reason yeah. why the feds are calling these people coded names. They don't want them to get killed. They don't want them to get threatened. They, they have a strategy, right? But we're fans, and we want to figure out everything now, right? So, like, yeah. you know what I mean? I guess it's federal, but I would think more federal is me saying, well, what about this guy over here? I think he should be charged. Like, And his name ain't mentioned at all. And my whole thing, I don't think they got full cases on those conspiracy guys. They got to get some more stuff. Because oh, no, no, no. I yeah, feel like no, I they... Huh? Hey, no, I agree. Hey, by the way, you yeah, gotta realize. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, but him to get Dirk and just say that he paid and did all of that, like, you gotta have proof of the currency being exchanged yo. and shit. You can't just fucking say that somebody paid. Yo, yo, hold on. So you know what's gonna happen with Dirk, right? I'm gonna tell you. So what's gonna happen with Dirk is this: we're gonna figure out his lawyers by the time he gets to to um. He already got lawyers, but they didn't appear on the record. So um. By the time he gets to Cali, his lawyers are going to say this. Yo, y'all indicted those other five guys. Y'all gave a complaint. The, the difference between a federal complaint is that you have a federal agent, one federal agent that wrote up something that he believes that the judge signed off on. That's not as strong as a grand jury indictment. A grand jury means that usually in, in most places or if it's state like, you know, I know for here, it's 23 people 
they're going to vote, and they need 12. So they need majority rules. 12 people to say there's probable cause that they could issue an indictment. So at least at least you get a jury of your own peers or a grand jury. With a complaint, it means that's a singular cop that did it. You know why they did it for Dirk? They felt Dirk was going to run to Italy. So essentially, the reason why they arrested him before he ran, they do have an indictment that they're trying to run through the grand jury, but it's not ready yet. And yeah, they didn't they think didn't he was going to run know. when these niggas got locked up because he was going to be a part of the superseded indictment. But once they seen he was trying to run, they said, fuck it, we got to lock him up. Yeah. So, 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 so all right, let me go down the list. So, Coke and Spirit of One, that's the boss. That, that, that's Dirk. Coke and Spirit of Two, this is going to be interesting because he did the sliding. Yo, I ain't going to lie to you, in the history of like, Looking at some of these cases and whatever the cases, when I seen the Young Dolph situation that that the shooter who fired the first shot was snitching, it didn't make sense to me. That's the nigga who's probably the biggest reason why Dolph is dead. He he ran up with a mini Draco. He ran no he ran up with a Dra he ran up with a Draco and he shot first at Dolph and he snitched on the other nigga who ran up with a Glock. What? How does the guy who fired the first bullet snitch on the other guy? Because the one that get the most intel is the one that's gonna get the bigger, the bigger, the the, the, the more time off. Bingo. So, of all the three shooters, the shooters are Jones, Lindsay, and co-conspirator two, and we've heard nothing. We don't know the co-conspirator two's name, and we don't know if he's in custody. That's odd. Hey, we get it. Murder for hire. But how y'all going to lock up five people and one of the three shooters is still free and y'all won't name his name? That sounds like somebody doing some shit, right? Yeah. That's why I think Co-Conspirator 2 is, 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 is telling. Then Co-Conspirator 3, I think that's an assistant. They got an OTF credit card. They spend on flights, travel, rental car. And it don't know that it, it, it doesn't seem apparent that Dirk is saying, Yo, book this flight for these people because they're going to go kill Quando. It doesn't look like that. It feels like it's a regular flight booker. Yo, we going to L.A. I need my guys there. Get their info and book their flights. Don't put nothing on their mind. Yeah, just don't put it on their mind. Hey, you yeah. might take... I'm pretty sure that's a conversation. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a conversation they've had before. So I don't think that person's in on it. Now, co-conspirator four, who they thought you were, that nigga got the drop. They got the drop on Quando's hotel. Now, I think it's local to LA, but you just pointed out something very important. And chat, we, we got to look at this. Who was Dirk hanging around with right after November 6th? So right after, right after Vaughn got killed, if co-conspirator four was, you know, close enough that he's hitting them with coded lang language, about sliding on Quando, that person was around since then, that's four years ago, and around till now, damn near. We yeah. imagine. But they're not from OTF. That's what we know. They, they're called an OTF affiliate. So that's the person we're going to find out. I, we're going to find out in court who it is. I personally think um, Brick, I think you know who that is. You don't got to tell me. I'm going with your stream, right? Okay, all right. Now, so, we, so we're so at Coast... All right, we get past Co-Conspirator 4. Then we get to Co-Conspirator 5. It don't really say much about Co-Conspirator 5 other than Co-Conspirator 5 is the one who's implicated in asking Co-Conspirator 2 to go to Southern California. It don't really say too much about co-conspirator five, which that's the odd part. Now, let me go into the people who are named, like OTF DD. His name is Wilson. He's the one who supposedly recruited. He recruited Lindsey Jones Houston. Houston is um the guy who drove. So so the car that pulled up where they killed um like the guys hopped out and they killed Pop. There was a driver who stayed in the car. So there was four people in the car. The, the, the guy who didn't hop out and shoot was a driver. His name is Houston. 
But everybody in that car was recruited by OTF Didi, according to the feds. And, um, yeah, I said top target, Coke Spirit 1, the big dog, which is Dirk, clearly. And see, go ahead. That, that, so, with them knowing that, I feel like the wire wasn't worn. If there was a wire, it wasn't worn during the drill. I feel like the driver, I mean, uh, the, 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 the informant who was wearing the wire waited until they was having these mo- Oh my God. Why every time I touch this damn phone? Hold on, hold on. Oh my God. Brick was about to break it down. Yo, Chad, I've gotten like 800 calls. Man, y'all really hate me, don't y'all? Hold on, let me call Brick back. Let me call him back. Let me call him back. Chat, is it, it's a little chat. It's a little bit better that I just got brick by himself, right? I feel like. Uh, shit, I went out. Yeah, no, no. I, I think I hit a button. Chat, I, I think it's better with me just having brick by by himself, right? Like you know, because we, we were just a bunch of arguments before. We're kind of getting somewhere here. Yeah, I just feel like whoever wore the if it was a wire, it was during family conversations and i ain't trying to like i'm not here to to bust down the case federally i'm just going over the paperwork with you because it's public information and my boys free to guy but whatever public information and they can just run it my boys is going through i'm just saying that for the <laughs> record because everybody you know they like to slander brick no, no, like, no. Oh, he teamed up with Act to take down OTF. That's the new fucking narrative. No, 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 no. But, but also, like, it, it, you know, I think I've been pretty honest and upfront, even with you. When I first saw you on No Jump, I thought you were a horrible podcast. Why? I thought you were too high. I, I'm gonna be honest with you. I just thought you were too high. Over time, I think you know because we all like everybody know I drink, right? Like, and whatever you do is whatever you do. I think you learn to control it at a level that you could add valuable insight because podcasting is all about conveying thoughts and now you're like way better than you were before right and a lot of times when i hear you talk i'm like okay he's giving like the opinion of like a street dude and how it would normally go down the street which which that's very because i like that because i don't think like you like, I'm never going to think yeah. like you. You get what I'm saying? So when I hear you something like, well, when you're like, well, like, I, this is the best thing I like what you do on, on No Jumper. You're like, well, I ain't going to lie. Sometimes it do go down like this. Based, and I'm like, oh, shit, okay, that do make sense, right? And what you just pointed yeah. out to me, what you just pointed out to me is actually like, it just made me think. Why would a nigga wearing a wire go do the hit, right? So if he was wearing a wire before the hit, why would he go do the hit? Like, that sounds crazy. If you're wearing a wire, you're trying to wear the wire to get out of some shit, why go do the hit <laughs> with the wire? If you got the wire on, yeah, if you got the wire on during the hit, right? <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. The feds, the feds can't let somebody working take part in taking somebody's life, and they know it's about to happen, and they don't stop it just to build a case. Yeah. You know what type of lawsuit they got, that family got on their hands? Like, no, that's a fact. I agree with you. I mean, if they let him knock somebody off, that means, it, 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 and then they don't do nothing about it, they come back years later and then charge him, like, oh, man. No. Yeah, no, I agree with you. And this is why I'm op- <laughs> I'm open to, you know, I th- we're going to find out much more later. Um, right now, the internet is jumping to the most likely conclusions. This is why they're saying, oh, Brick is, is co-conspirator four and this and third. Hey, I'm not saying Jam not might be be into some shit, but what we should really think about is that maybe Co-Conspirator 2 is not him, and maybe Co-Conspirator 2 is some other person. We got to think outside the box. Yeah. We're going to find out a lot of shit. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. What, 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 what's coming, they already got who they were. Remember they come and drop the gavel on whatever they got going on. You know what I mean? They'll all see what's going on. Everybody will see what's going on. You know what I mean? 
and I don't I don't know too much. Like I know everybody wants me to know a lot, but that's why I got online and anybody from OTF about me and my brother ain't been around each other like that, like recently. Like we we'll talk from time to time, send love out, whatever, bro. Are you good? Boo do 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 be straight. Yeah, you know I mean he always take it in and straight. You know me, I ain't gonna keep asking for no no handout or nothing like that. But I know what he mean by if you straight, he just probably see me going through some shit or whatever. Like you straight, like I'm straight, but you know I'm gonna get it together. You know what I mean? Like I'm I'm known to get it together. So hey, shit like that. When's, like, the, when's the last time you talked to talk to Dirk? Like last month. Really? Okay, okay. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to reveal no nah, DMs nah, you, and no, nah, nah, you don't got shit, to. But don't yeah, got yeah, to. but probably like, probably like last month, we got into a, a, a butt hurt argument. Me being butt hurt, feeling like he taking over his shit. And he just told me he been with the family and with his girl and shit. Ain't nothing personal. Cause he had been in LA a couple times without calling me, but maybe he knew something I didn't know. I don't know. So, so um, I can't remember when I did an interview with him, but there was a part of me, like, you know, after the interview, I remember he was talking a lot about not only therapy, which I was a little bit shocked by, but he was also talking about religion. This is before we see a lot of the obvious, you know, some of the religious, you know, rituals that he was doing. Um, what I kind of noticed, though, he was kind of backing up off a lot of people, and, 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 I, and I don't know why, right? Like... If you ask me, I was thinking that, you know, man, yeah, he too. realized he had to let go of some of that shit to really escalate. And, you know, I, I think for me, in my opinion, I could be wrong. Once the whole thing with, you know, people were saying Sly Favon, okay. once he felt at peace with that, he ain't need to keep having these fictional beefs because everybody who he really got into it with or he had a problem with he handled that and and i felt like he was just saying bro i'm, I'm moving to a different direction also his father coming home so that's why i feel like he was i feel like away his father shit. coming home had a lot to do with his online presence after that like if it, nobody was gonna get through to him it was gonna be his father mm. like you know, you know what i mean no, like i, I felt like if anybody was going to slow him down, it has something to do with him telling him he already lost one son and you need to figure out a way to get it back together because when I left the street, the GDs and the BDs was under the same umbrella. Now we beef it. I feel like it went something like that. Yeah. Wow. Nah, nah. You know what I mean? Like, when, I we, either way, when his dad left, now you got me feeling weird because... The little niggas from where I'm from, they see me with you like, damn, huh? Your son, shit, he been dissing the set the whole time you been gone, man. Mm. Damn. You know? So I feel like, and then Tay coming home on the positive vibe with the with the Muslims and the way Tay was probably putting it down before he left, I feel like everybody just got in line with Tay. And J Main just happened to be one of the people that Tay was willing to forgive because J Main ain't never did nothing to Tay. Yeah, it's vice versa. It's up to it's up to it's up to Tay to you, you know what I'm saying. It's up to J Main to forgive. It ain't really on Tay. He already it, issued out his blow allegedly. You know what I mean when they when they be talking whenever he be hinting to whatever problems they yeah. had in the past. And, and let me ask you. Let me ask you this question. Um, and, and you know, you know, I've talked to Dirk. You know, Dirk usually checks up on me. The first time I met him was during the interview. Um, I'm not gonna say I'm like super close to him, but I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I think because I've covered him so for so long, when he got locked up, man, I kind of felt the way, man. I I I kind of felt a little hurt. You know, what I mean, obviously, you know, I'm a civilian. I'm not in that life, but like, I really, I really fuck with Dirk, and I like him. What what did you feel? I, I know you was on a stream where you were kind of like processing, but like even after the stream and kind of now you're you're seeing everything on online. W what do you feel in just kind of watching that? Man, I had just posted probably two days before that, probably on his birthday, us playing basketball in my living room. We I used to have a basketball court in the living room. We used to always play one on one and shoot around when he had the low haircut. 
I just was like, I just see you go from rags to riches. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you know it hurt. Like, it's, it's like when I see slime go down, like, damn, I see you at your, one of your lowest, probably not your lowest lows, but one of your lowest moments, I definitely was like, riding it out with you. You know what I'm saying? We both was going through some shit together and came up. You know what I'm saying? So, mm. I, uh, to see him just wiped off the streets over, 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 allegedly, trying to settle a score for somebody. How that how that situation went down, me not being from the hood, I just be like, damn. I wish somebody could see and just take it as an L like damn. The homie the homie punched the nigga and his homie popped the nigga like, you know what I mean? Like, but you when you coming from where we come from, like the concrete jungle, you can't really let that go. It was blood shit. So if it is true, you know what I mean? Like if all this shit is true then I just hate to see my homeboy played off the streets like that. You know what I'm saying? Because really, at the end of the day, it all look, goes back to looking out, re- going back to the com- community and, and looking out for the community. How it backfires on you like Nipsey Hussle. How it backfires on you like so many stories that we can point back to when everybody goes back and lends a helping hand to the community. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, let me ask you a question. Do you, do you think... Um, when you think about the totality of it, do you? Let's we're gonna assume for devil's advocate purposes is is what people think it is. Oh, Dirk Dirk might have been involved in some shit, but he was sliding for his man's. Do you look at that as stupid, or you being from the streets, you're like, I know the pressure, bro. I know the pressure after to make them decisions. It ain't easy. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. like, at any time that you get an open, now he, granted, he let that shit go. Let's say he let that shit go. And the devil knocked on his door one morning like, boy, I know where he at. Mm. He only had so much time to react. If it, If it's true, you only had so much time. Should I give him a pass or no? Shit, nigga, the first time you didn't hurt, you know where he at. And it ain't no show. It ain't no hundred people around. It ain't no, you know what I mean? Hey, 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 that's like a gut check time, right? Where, like, people probably looking at you to see if, like, you are who you probably says you are. Exactly. Exactly. Like, nigga, do you sit or do you stand when you piss, nigga? Like in the streets, they, like like as a man, you look at it different. But in the streets, I know how we looking at it. But like as a civilian and a man, it's like shit. You know what I mean? You willing to let that shit go a little bit? You know what I mean? Do, do, do you believe that also? Like you see, Dirk had, you know, Dirk had some of the lyrics that people love. Be like, yo, if you can't get the main, the main nigga, you better get his man's or whatever it is. You get what I mean? And you know. Yeah. D- Dirk basically now nah, he talked that talk pretty good. Do, do you do you believe that there's a possibility that maybe like man that's more even more pressure because everybody around you is like nigga we know what you rap about this gonna be if we know what you stand about and, and, and how do you and how could you say no and can you say no basically saying yo bro I'm in a position I can't do that right now how does that work? Yeah, that's what I'm like. I, I, I just, I mean, of course he did not do it. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. I, he didn't do it. But yeah, yeah, no, I can I, see. Yeah, yeah we're I trying to extrapolate being, off of Dirk. I, I can see myself facing that yeah. same situation. How, what would you do? I can see myself facing that same situation and have to make a hard decision, bro. And I don't know if I would have made the right decision. Knowing, you get what I'm saying? I don't know. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't know if I would have made the right decision, the same decision. You know what I'm saying? Like, because it's just like the hurt. That, like, you got to think somebody's scoring if it's true. Mm. Yeah. But I feel like he was, uh, hopefully, I feel like, hopefully that they got him fucked up and this it wasn't no wiretap or nothing. And they just like, you know what I mean? Putting his name in the middle of that shit. And you know what I mean? Get, I think the, the, I think the feds is a scary, scary place. I'm gonna be honest with you. There's a, there's a thought of mine. 
there's a thought of mine that says when the feds unseal this indictment, they're going to have every attempt on Quando Rondo's life, which w there was supposedly like three or four before. They might have, oh, F man. they might have FBG cash. They might have other situations. They might bring that, that Atlanta joint back that he was co-defendants with Vaughn. Wait, know. this is the, the indictment still still? What, what, you got to remember, they gave a complaint. The complaint is more to lock him up. The complaint doesn't have the info on what they believe Dirk did. Right, like, like it says certain shit, but, but uh, you're right, you're right, you're so, right, because that, that, because that paperwork, I've never been to the feds, so I just didn't know they format of how they, how they do paperwork, because I was looking for like the statements and the interrogations, no, no, and all so, that. You know, so like, the indictment that the, was just the warrant. Yeah, so the indictment has it. So, so once again, I, 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 I'll tell y'all what a, a so uh, the easiest way for me to explain to you is this, right? Yo, if you driving right now in Cali, um, they pull you over. I don't, I don't know if, um, well, we, we, we is illegal, but, but say whatever. They look in the back seat. They see something that resembles a gun, right? Weapons are pretty much illegal. Um, say they run your file. They know you don't got no concealed carry. They're going to say, I got probable cause to go search the car. Or even say, or say, or say they, they know something is up and they bring a, a dog sniffer to sniff the car. They, they feel like yeah, they something's there, the weed. right? Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. and let's say it's coke. Let's say it's coke. All right, now they search the car. There's coke there. That's a heavy charge. They don't need to grand jury you. What happens is that how you get charged is that that cop does a complaint, and that complaint gets picked up by the DA as a felony. They, they, they go beyond. They, they actually skip the grand jury. Now for yeah. now for things like murder and stuff like that, even if there's a complaint, they'll lock you up. They, but, but just cross their T's and dot their I's, they'll send it back to a grand jury or have a grand jury do it. But in for regular shit with cops, not in federal court, a cop doing a complaint is how you get arrested for ninety five percent of the things. Yeah. In federal court. Federal court don't have a bunch of DEA. Like, if you running around and you met, like, a DEA agent, an FBI agent, you're doing something wrong. You're not going to see these people. Like, they they don't have even the resources just to be at every stop sign or on every road. So what they so do is... Go ahead. Yeah, so what they do is they do investigations. And when they do investigations, they bring it to a grand jury without you even knowing. So the, the, the majority of how... Federally, you get indicted is through a grand jury. The reason why they locked up Dirk through a complaint, which usually some state shit, or like how states do it, where a cop pulls you over and you know he smells some stuff or he sees something and then he locks you up. The reason why the feds did it is because they thought Dirk was gonna run. So the mere fact they locked him up is because they know they're cooking up a grand jury indictment. And that indictment, I think, is not only going to have this murder for hire, it's going to be a superseding indictment. It might be racketeering, or it might have other murders and other attempted murders. And that's going to be the big bang. So, like, in a week or two weeks from now, I don't know how long it's going to take for him to get to Cali. When that indictment is on sealed, we're going to see some shit we've never seen before. They're going to link him to shit. Trust me, that's going to be the big one. Because right now, th this was just to get him locked up. They ain't tell everything they really think he did. Is Mama Duck satisfied? <laughs> Man. Well. <sighs> I mean, I know she's satisfied there. What do you think about her? What do you think about her? I... I just feel like she played both. So I just feel like she come for the streets, and then when her family got involved with with being slain and being the victim or whatever, she started playing more victim. I don't think that she was preaching to her kids to leave the streets alone when they was in the streets due to the stories that she got of them. Mm. No, I completely get that point. Um, and you know, I I heard you talk about this on No Jumper. And I wish I was there to debate it because 
this is the angle I will come at. I agree with you that she's someone who embraces streets, and now she going the, the route of filing a lawsuit seems to be very hypocritical. But my argument yeah. would be that the streets have no rules, and this isn't something where it says to the victor goes to spoil. So Yeah, no, nah, for sure. That's why I said you can't tell her out of more, and I'm just saying she should have been on that. She probably could have saved their life if she would have been preaching Oh, no, no, that. of course. No, she likes accountability for allowing an environment and also um, kind of ignoring the behavior. Yeah, ignoring the yeah. behavior or even gassing it up that got her kids killed. That's a fact. That's a yeah. fact. But let 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 eight gang members kick it at your house all day, nigga, and load they straps up, smoke weed, sell weed, all that shit. That shit is nigga, and not saying nothing about it is 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 damn near nigga. You know what I mean? You probably smoking the blunt with them niggas. You get know what I'm saying? Them your boys. Like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't looking at it like that, but you are contributing to what's going on. No, no, of course. Hey. As a parent. Um, Hey, hey, so, um, you know, as we were talking about how we think Dirk could get out of this, and by the way, chat, um, we're going to get to this tonight, too. I did a review of, uh, um, you know, people say, allegedly, Vaughn has seven bodies. And, and I'm flabbergasted because I'm like, how could somebody beat or not get convicted for seven murders? And what you're going to realize is that the majority of cases with, with with Vaughn, why he didn't get locked up at those times, people didn't testify against him. There weren't people wearing wires. There weren't people pointing them out. Obviously, in the dirt case, this is. And I looked at it to say, either Vaughn was smart enough to make sure there was no witnesses or maybe just by the natural order things there wasn't. But I'm like, could Dirk have that same look where the witnesses... Stop witnessing. Yeah, when they get on the stand, they might. I mean, if it's some real niggas, they might have that that self check when they look in the mirror. Like, damn, I gotta walk with this forever. I gotta try to clear it up. I don't know. If they got a piece of real nigga in them, they gonna try to retract their statements. Do you think the time has changed? Do we see people like Woody. We see other people like. I don't know if it's a scar. I don't. I don't think it's the most shameful thing anymore to be a snitch. Do you think so? Nah, but this is the thing. Out here, they got snitch gangs in the prisons. They got all this stuff where they against people that go with the code. So it's like it's changed. There's more protective custody yards in California than there is general general population yards. You can look it up. Really? Yes. By the way, um, you know, someone like you who have been incarcerated before. Um, I seen Charleston White say this, so I, I'm, I'm gonna repeat it to you, and, and hopefully you can give me some clarity. He said, "Listen, Lil Durk is a BD. He's heading towards California, where he's gonna be incarcerated, um, probably in a holding facility, but it could be at a part of a wing of of maybe LA County Jail. Who knows? I don't know where the holding facility for Fed federal inmates are. No, they got they all they got MDC. They got they all holding facility. Okay. Now, he, here's the point, though." People have notoriously said that the thing with L.A. is about bloods and curves. It's about gangs, right? When, when you have somebody who's like a BD, a black disciple, who comes in, um, does Dirk have anything to worry about, you know, when he gets into that incarceration penal system? and Tato system? was in L.A. County with us. Tato, okay. Tato was in L.A. County with us. He was on in general population with the Crips and the Bloods. We just, you know, tell them our program and how, how it's ran out here. Shit, you're going to be considered a non-affiliate on this side of town. You know what I mean? Like, shit. You really? I mean, a you got a couple. Well, in L.A., you're not going to be, like, when the phase is this, you know, who the hell is he going to fight? Like, we don't beef with him, so it's like, you kind of not affiliated with our gang politics. Like, we ain't going to treat you like a, a, a... We don't treat non-affiliates like... You know what I mean? Go wait, wait. So, so BDs you know don't mean? have a presence in Cali at all? Nah. Really? Uh-uh. So, so y'all will look at him like a... All right, so is a non-affiliate a non is not a civilian, though, right? 
Nah, nah, well, it is, but it'll be, well, we wouldn't look at him as not a failure. You a gangbanger from over there, but, like, y'all don't beef with bloods or crips, so you don't fall into our politics. So when we politicking, like, you don't, unless it's on some black against Mexican shit, we really not going to have you in the huddle when it comes to gangbang. Wow. You get what I'm saying? Like, uh, you no, got that pass. You don't got to do no fighting. You ain't got to do no nothing. All you got to do is go do your time and stay out the way, man. You can come kick it with us. You know what I'm saying? Whoever you kick it with, you kick it with. That's different. But, like, all that other shit, we ain't really looking at it like that. Like, Tato was with us, thugging. It ain't like he had to fight our enemies and nothing like that. He just was with us. Mm. Hey, um, all right, cool. I do want to ask you a, a slightly a personal question. You, somebody who come from the streets, I feel like you know podcasting have helped you. I, I think Adam has put you in a great position. I think No Jumper has helped you, and you've helped yourself. Has there been moments where I, I think I had said this to you? I called in to, to Flacco when y'all were doing a news stream, and I said I thought there was a moment you were go you were gonna crash out. And I think a lot of people are waiting for you to crash out and either not necessarily put yourself in jail, but like maybe put yourself in a position where doing a podcast isn't the thing anymore. How close well, have you ever got to that? Well, this is the thing. Learning from every mistake that I've made, I've never really. After that moment is up, and you go back to the house and clear your head and say you just got tricked into some internet shit. I think the next day and the days after that, it's like, I'm not beefing with them. They don't even have a presence in my life. These people are on the internet. I had a debate or whatever disagreement with somebody. I got real ops in the street, so they'd be like, you ready, man? Go get your get back for what you got to go get your get back for if that's what you're going to do. Don't waste your time with this shit. Mm. That makes and sense. It, it, it levels you back to you wasn't looking for your ops the day before that. You get what I'm saying? They don't got nothing to do with this drama. Go on ahead, walk straight, and try to get your money. I done fucked up too many times, and I'm watching people fuck up in real time. So it's like... For me to join the wave of jumping in some shit that could give me a Rico or get me wiped off the streets forever when it's a trend of getting people in our genre off the streets right now, I don't think I'm going to let... I'm not going to play into that narrative ever. But it has been times where it's been like, okay, this ain't no street shit, Brick. This ain't me. And I'm telling myself that the back to back. The Kill you know Squad I mean? moment, you were ready to crash out. Yeah. Definitely, hundred percent. That you, was the wake up call. Do you do you regret how I won't say emotional, but but like how like it felt like you were sincere, like all right, fuck it, like this shit don't mean nothing compared to my integrity. Did you regret allowing others or situations to get you to that? I regret allowing it, but then sometimes you gotta drop drop your nets when enough is enough, like. Certain situations won't even happen no more due to me doing that. You get what I'm saying? Like, certain content won't be ran. Certain Everybody got the message. Mm. You know what I mean? And it, it, it wasn't the, the, the illest message. It wasn't like I was just trying to put down a, a demo of how gangster I could be. It's just like, all right, y'all know what pushes bricks to his limits. I know what pushed me to my limits, so those are no longer my limits because I've exceeded that moment, so that means that that's not my limit. You get what I'm saying? No, no, I completely get it. Would you so it's like everybody learns something out the situation, so I don't think I'll ever be back in that predicament. Hopefully not. Hey, w w would you ever sit down with Wack? I can't believe y'all never met y'all are no drummer. <laughs> I sit down with Wack, man. I sit down with Wack, but with Wack, not with Wack and Loose Cannon and all them extra people. Like, Wack, Why do you think he brings Wack. Loose Cannon in 600? Do you think he's trolling you or he feels like y'all have some issues? He's just trying to irritate somebody else, bro, and I'm not in it for that. Hmm. You know what I'm saying. Yeah, no, no, I get it. I get it. Yeah, yeah, I think that's what that is. Like, I made your boy sit down with him, too. Like, nah. We ain't doing that. 
because them people from the same area I'm from, we ain't supposed to hash out our problems right there. We supposed to go do that in our area. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Yo, yo, hey, listen. Sad to say, Lil Dirk has been booked, man. It's going to be a lot of videos coming out about Lil Dirk, man. This is honestly sad, bro. I'm, I'm going to keep it a being like, this is actually sad, like genuinely sad. Lil Dirk literally had such a, I don't want to say such a promising career because he still has his career right now. He has his album coming out in a month. He had, like Lil Dirk has so much positive going for him. Like. This case for him is how I see if Lil, if King Vaughn was still alive for the FBG duck case. Like, he would have got booked the same way. And they're going to pin everything on Dirk. There's already snitches. Like what Rex said, there's a murder involved. Murder for hire. <clears throat> they're probably going to come with a RICO case after. This is not state charges. This is federal charges too. So it's very, very, very much different. Man... I seen a. I can't really say what I want to say because you know YouTube is very weird. But seeing Dirk changed his religion recently, they said it's good to be that specific religion while in jail. Which I agree. You see a lot of you feel me, people, that religion. You feel me? It's like a they're like a group in jail. And they stay together, which is good. But man, going from being a eight, probably nine figure man. You know, private jets, you know, mansions to a cell, man. That must do something to you mentally that you can't even fathom, bro. And Lil Dart, honestly, he's like rap wise, he's like up there. Like he's the 21 Savages, whichever tier is the Lil Babies, 21 Savage. You put Lil Dirk right in that tier. Like the tear right under the Kendricks, J. Cole's, Drake's, them. He's literally the tear right below them. And, you know, it's sad. Lil Dirk's been in the game for so long, man. He told him about Slide for Vaughn. He allegedly really did Slide for Vaughn. Now he's in this situation. All we could do is pray and hope for the best. Um, You know, I am consider myself a realist. And I'm looking at the situation, their snitches, like all the evidence, like OTF cards for everything. And bro, like Lil Dirk is ahead of all of this. Like, I really just hope he doesn't. If Lil Dirk gets life in prison, that's, I know his heart's going to drop. And how Lil Dirk says that he hates snitches, how much he prides himself on hating snitches. Like, I always wonder to myself, if it's someone in Lil Dirk's position, if it's either life in prison or you snitch and you get five to ten years, are you snitching? Would you throw your whole life away? You're not going to get to see any of your kids physically grow up anymore. All your money, you have all this money right now, but that money is not, you're the breadwinner, bro. Like five to ten years, twenty years, who knows? All your, the families connected to you might be broke. Like, you're the breadwinner, bro. Like, it's a crazy world we live in, bro. I genuinely feel bad for Dirk. And, but, man, it's hard to even feel bad for Dirk because then you'd have to feel bad for Quando. And it's the whole situation is just sad because it, it's all this literally started from King Vaughn and Jania, bro. King Vaughn, Asian doll, Jania, like, it's just woman, bro. Woman caused this whole thing to happen. It was a chain reaction, and now we're here. But it's your boy, Big Egg News. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and please, 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 please don't. Like, woman holds so much power, bro. Like, it's so crazy. And I'm out.